Welcome back, guys. Welcome back, welcome back. We just finished the uh, Dragon Ball stream and we raided into a new FF7 stream. Let's give everybody a minute. Hey, what's up, Vanessa? Right now we're in the Gee Cave. Hey, no worries, Duck Man. All right, guys, give me a chat. Give me a sec. I'm gonna use the bathroom and uh, grab a snack, and I'll be right back.
Hey. Back, chat. We're back. It is time. something real quick Sorry about that. Just making sure everything's running good. Thoughts on a new voice? I don't know if I'll ever get used to it. I don't hate it. I think it's just kind of funny. <laughs> Hearing him in combat though is pretty funny though. Like he's he's like really overconfident in combat and talking shit. That's my Nanaki. Mm. Ooh. Look at all this puzzling. Mm -hmm. Oh my god. I thought he died. Of course, there's a reason to go up here. It is pretty funny though, like when he was trying to say goodbye and be all tough. And Aerith was like, well then, I guess this is goodbye. And he's like, aw, don't say that. It makes me feel bad. <laughs> he's like so emotional. Ah, uh, yes. The puzzles, chat. Does a new episode of Solo Leveling drop tomorrow? It's Saturday morning, right? Not Sunday morning? I hope it's Saturday morning. himself the burden of our hope. Hmm. Let's see my audio settings real quick. One of my friends just called me. Dun, dun.
he's like, yo, did you see Dune 2 yet? I'm like, no, I'm watching Dune 1 tomorrow. <laughs> Oh, let me change my lights real quick. How are you playing this? You saw Rad Brad's video? What do you mean, uh, Devious? Somebody wants to tell him that she's like 14 in that flashback. Who? Especially over Yellow Flash, you put out that video saying the game is a sales disaster and complaining about censorship because they got rid of Tifa's cleavage in the flashback outfit. What the fuck? Who's Yellow Flash? Why is he talking about like Japan physical sales, which consoles are never a, the, the breadwinner over there? When technically this outsold Elden Ring in Japan. Technically, it did. And we all know how much Elden Ring sold. Don't worry, guys. We get those full digital numbers. It'll be all right. And in my opinion, I'm not worried about sales, bro. That's for Square Enix to worry about. This game is fire. This game's amazing. It's worth everything that they put into it. And ultimately, at the end of the day, uh, people that want to pick this up and will pick this up and play it will enjoy it and they'll see for themselves that this is a really good product and to me that's all that matters at the end of the day hey i got you dylan no worries bro i'm on proud Whoa. mode we just gotta finish up something what is it oh shit manifests once more Not this oh, that's from the trailer. Mm -hmm. I was kind of hoping there would be a face on the wall that transforms into an enemy again. Hey, what the fuck, bro? It wouldn't let me. I was trying to spam my shit on that. I did heal him. What the hell? I healed and damaged him. Alright, huh? What about an X potion? A thousand? Oh my god. We got plenty of Phoenix downs to waste. Let's see. expect to get into the boss fight so soon. Like 
love the switch bear. Let's ass ass him. Inflicting enough damage or pressure, curse a curse will activate when the soul flames possess a statue. Huh. Staggering him will undo the curse. Doom will inflict instant death after a certain amount of time. I live for this shit. Fuck on this. Stay down, asshole. You're up. All right, my time to shine. What the? Who the fuck you think you are, dashing around like that, you fucking bitch? He's sucking my boy. with that catastrophe. This animation is long, so I'm just going to focus on this. I'm curious. Oh, that did reduce damage. Shit. Pretty fast. Fucking Doom Countdown. Oh my god, that animation is crazy. What does it say? Staggering will undo the curse. No, that wasn't it. Doom will inflict instant death after a certain amount of time. Okay, it doesn't get rid of that. This right here is the power of the planet. Magic pot. Yo, this track picked up. My boy. Fuck, man. My guy is not giving me a chance. I'll take care of the rest. I forgot what Magic Pot does. Does it give me? It gives me elixir. Are you kidding me? Right as Red died. We got it Uh, 
Wrong person. It does interrupt the shit out of him. On red. That shit up, bro. Oh my god, oh my god, oh my god. Don't take it personally, alright? Come on, Red. Returning to the live stream. man that was it that was the kill all right we gotta block more I'm not blocking as much and that fucked me up there that was that would have been so epic too well at least we know limit isn't immune from doom counter These attacks that actually like lift you are so annoying. I feel like all of his do. My eyes. What the hell? What was that? Did I keep my synergy? I did keep my synergies, okay. Sucks. That was a good one. Oh. 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 Oh.
He, he did some of these two last time. Like twice in a row like that. I'm using these elixirs. Fuck it. Stun him, and then we're gonna go into LB again. Hello. Yeah, you can't block that. Oh, yeah. I'm not gonna Howling Moon. Are you serious? I fucking wasted that? God damn it. Kidding me? One more? Fucking bitch. Keep forgetting to use synergy skills. I'm not gonna lie, chat. Form evanescent, rancor everlasting. Well done. You've become quite the formidable fighter. <laughs> sure have. <laughs> so, does this mean I passed the test? <laughs> I'm afraid that decision is not mine alone to make. <sighs> Let us consult with one more qualified. Oh shit, Chad, is this the moment here? Okay. This is uh this is something I've been really excited on since this project was announced. The Watcher of the Vale fought valiantly and offered up his life in defense of our home. As you see, he still watches over us to this very day. Wait, is that... Seto? My father? No, there's no way. 
The poisoned arrows of the Gi transformed his body into stone. And there he has stood ever since, his watch eternal. Our savior. What about my mom? Did she know what had happened to him? Oh, oh, oh. Why, of course she did. It was, after all, she and Seto who asked me to see her off the cave. But why? Why did she never tell me the truth? Because she knew that if she did, you would attempt to seek your father out all by yourself. Your parents strove to keep our veil safe. But there is one thing they fought even harder to protect. You, Nanaki, their son. She was afraid because I was too small and weak. <laughs> Back then, perhaps, but not anymore, heavens no. You've become a fine warrior in your own right. And that is precisely why I brought you here. <laughs> but this is not where your journey is meant to end, my dear boy. You must leave the Vale once more. But I'm a watcher now. I gotta protect our home like he did. Listen to me, Mama Ki. When I first heard your friend's emphatic warnings, I dismissed them outright. No more than the ravings of misguided youths. When you've lived as long as I have, you start to believe you've seen it all. But no surprises remain. But I realize now how very they were following behind us low. The eyes that I thought saw the world clearly have grown blind to new possibilities. But... I would hate to impede your progress any further. I bid you leave, Nanaki. Before, like me, you become inured to your own ignorance. With sharper eyes and keener ears, go forth and in my stead seek the great truths of our world! Look after him for me. So Yuffie and Tifa? We will. They said something to each other. This trial, my boy. Continue your training and try again. Are you up to the task, Nanaki? You bet I am. After all. I am Nanaki. Watcher of Cosmo Canyon. And son of Seto. Protector of our veil. Ah, oh, the tears. Did we not just fight him? Oh, brave and noble he Seto. looks so different. I beseech you once more. Hear the urgent pleas of my people. My thanks, Seto. You are as magnanimous as ever. The warrior Nanaki. And you. The Cetra. Come with me. What is 
this? That was... Oh, an exciting turn of events indeed. We'll back you up for two thousand. But... <laughs> of course. No. This one's free. Wow, that's a new inclusion. Ah, uh, come on, man. They didn't even give us time to, like, to grieve about that. Like, I just, I wanted to kind of just bask in this, like, moment for a second. And now we're immediately moving on to something else. Which is also very interesting. Gein attack? Did we not fight him? Yeah, he does sound like the voice of the trailer guy from the first trailer. Hell yeah, this is 1,000 times better than Remake, bro. I love how they the squad was following behind us close. <laughs> Yuffie ran up ahead. Ugh. Can anyone explain to me why we're even taking this detour? Anyone? Because some of us are on a mission to secure the material we need to, you know, save our homeland. How can you talk like that in a place like this? I'm scared of my wet's here. I don't know. This gee dude's too nice to freak me out. He may act nice, but who knows what he's planning. Stay alert. Uh Wow, okay. Remember what I was saying before that the cave didn't look like the cave from the OG? Now it's starting to look kind of very close to that now. The home of the gee lies beyond. Now let us begin our journey. Not so fast. What's in it for us? Unless it's Materia, you can count me out. How strange you should mention Materia. My people are also in search of it. <laughs> Yuffie, that means they don't have any. Okay, all aboard! <laughs> She's facing the wrong way. Longer if I could, but I'll be back soon. I promise. Dude, this is absolutely new. The river of sticks, kind of, yeah. Gina talk has different forms, most likely. Try swaying with the rocking of the boat. I want to move less, not more. <laughs> Didn't seem to mind when you jumped aboard. Well, only because he mentioned materia. Be quiet. The planet is listening. And what's wrong with that? Anything that reaches the planet's ears in due time reaches those of the Cetra. Unfortunately, the Cetra are not a tolerant people. Excuse me, am I intolerant too? I'm Cetra. <laughs> I love when she uses that joke. <laughs> you are indeed one of them. By lineage alone. You know not of their history. That has been lost to time. Oh. Their history? Consider your ignorance a blessing. The Cetra's past is fraught with horror and sorrow. God, Cloud has the worst seat in the house. How do I feel about Red's voice? So I, I don't Go mind around. it. It's taken a little bit to get used to. It's kind of Watching funny in battle. Go dark. More Zack stuff. Thinking, this is it. This is how it ends. Only, it isn't. 
Suddenly, the wind picks up out of nowhere. It tugs at me so hard, it feels like it's tearing my soul right out of my body. Hmm. Next thing I know, I'm back in the orphanage. But nobody can tell me who found me or how I got there. It's a miracle. Sounds like what happened to me. Whole freaking army unloading on my position. I'm feeling every single force. One minute, I'm outnumbered, and the next, I'm alone. None of it makes any sense. I somehow managed to beat the odds and wake up here, alone. Why in the hell did fate pick me? Can't think that way. <laughs> Can't not think that way. Their luck runs out, but mine doesn't. I'm the only one who gets a pass. <laughs> and now that it's just me, what am I supposed to do? You know? Yeah, I get it. Hey, come with me. Sure, but why? Gameplay? I'll explain on the way. <sighs> yeah, the whispers seem seems like they've been saved, but we don't know why yet. So, how's Cloud holding up? Marco <gasps> poisoning's done a real number on him. Doubt he's in for a speedy recovery either. But hey, hope springs eternal. Right. This is Beagle <laughs> Biggs. If he does recover, you can bet your ass he'll act like it was nothing. Shrug it off and say he's been through ten no times that shit. Are, are we talking about the same fire. cloud? No, <laughs> Come on. The guy's desperate Maybe to prove himself. Not like he needs to. Everyone knows he's a bona fide badass. Hey, Zach is so confused because his cloud is not like that. Uh, Zach of all trades. Why? Because one's not enough. He said Zack of all trades. So somehow this beagle... Biggs... Has been placed into this terrier area... This terrier, uh... Universe. Okay. Let's see. For a live stream. The destruction of Sector 7 was orchestrated by Shinra themselves. We can't let those murderers get away with it. People of Midgar fight back against our corporate oppressors by joining Avalanche. Seek us out at the lot off Petal Lane. Wow, that's bold. Yep. These guys are setting a trap for themselves. Shinra will just roll in and round them all up. Doubt public security will even bother going through the motions. Easier just to shoot and skip the paperwork. Then anyone who goes is... An idiot, I know. But idiots are what we need right now. Folks will risk it all. Wait! Don't tell me you're going! The things I do for friends. No, sir, we are going. Okay, this is, uh... This is, this is the most... <laughs> forward progress we've been getting on Zack's, uh, side hey, mission stuff. You ever wondered about your purpose in life? What you're doing here? Sure, from time to time. Or all the time. Would never have guessed. Didn't used to, but things changed. Went through a lot after I joined Shinra, like a lot. I bet. I ask, because ever since I woke up, I've been wondering about what to do with all this time I've been given. Hey. 
Hey, Biggs. You said before I ought to try picking up some work as a merc. Yeah. Because one's not enough. So who's the one? <laughs> Cloud. He didn't tell you? Must not have wanted the competition. When exactly did you meet Cloud? <gasps> the day before we hit Reactor 1. So... Uh, how long ago was that again? <laughs> Weird. My internal clock's busted. Yeah, mine too. What's that about anyway? <laughs> Good question. Yeah, because Zack technically surviving, right? Because Zack's supposed to die at the end of October. Reactor 1 got hit first week of December. So the timeline is all crazy, but they just they just alluded to right there that yeah, everybody's timeline is all messed up. They have no idea what's going on. They're losing track of time. So, what do you think's going to happen to our baby? Don't know. I just wish we could have seen their face. We've got Damn. That's sad. You know, I just hope I can prove mm -hmm. it's mine. I think I prefer being number two or three. Suits me much better. Yeah. Like, the guy who only has to worry camping. about the how. I just will get he doesn't have to decide on the what. A minor role? Exactly. <laughs> I'm no hero. So how come I was the one who got saved? Because someone needs you. You and your can-do attitude. Then who might that be? Oh, the turn-based uh, kids? Whoever brought you back, I guess? And assuming there was the someone... You were the guy with Aerith, right? Who could it have well, been? Do homework, <laughs> That's a good right? question. Dude, I have so many questions. There you go, okay. My stream labels wasn't working, sorry. Hell with it! Let's just do what we want! Start by robbing folks and stuff. It's just up ahead. Keep your eyes peeled. Copy. The guy's talking about just quitting and robbing people? 34 out of 400 mean? It's uh, how many members we have on the channel. We have 341 members on the channel out of 400. 400? I'm just no trying to hit a goal. Not a soul. Well, at least Shinra was a no-show too, right? Who's there? <laughs> hmm? Huh. New recruit? Uh, as if I'd ever join Avalanche. Her I eyes look different. I just came to see what kind of morons would fall for your dumbass propaganda, that's all. But I should have known. Nobody could be that stupid. <laughs> Anyway, I'm out, losers. <laughs> Guess why she brought a bag? I told you I wasn't cut out for a leading role. And here I thought I might have been saved for a reason. Some higher purpose. <sighs> Sorry for wasting your time. Tell him about Marlene. Marlene wants to see him. Biggs! It's up to us to find our own purpose. I mean, who says it's gotta be one way? Everyone's sitting back, acting like the world's doomed, but the future's not set in stone. We're not powerless. So long as we don't lose sight of what's important. You know, what matters most of all when the going gets tough. I don't know, hopes, dreams, maybe? Something like that. So long as we've got those. And hold on tight and never let go. Like this? Like, like your life depends on it. <laughs> the world's lucky to have you. It's a start. Hmm. Anyway, I gotta run. I'll be sure to pay a visit to Cloud when I get the chance. See ya. Think Please about what do. I said. I'm confused. 
Guess I should probably have Damn. Too. So they what did they confirm red 13, Tifa and Barrett are dead? That sucks. Oh, huh. We saw red wake up. Dang, can't melee these boxes. Kyrie forgot her backpack, which is filled with traveling supplies. Perhaps she hoped to join Avalanche after all. <laughs> Damn. She was bummed out. Go back to the school? Ah, uh, shit. It won't let me. This is the longest Zack portion we've played yet, chat. This keeps going. I'm back. Welcome home. Welcome home. Guess who I just saw? Biggs. Really? Uh. Said he'd visit too. Oh yay! <laughs> Did he say anything about Daddy or Tifa? No. Oh, uh, sorry, forgot to ask. Zach, would you mind checking on Aerith for me? Sure. <laughs> How could you forget? We're all headed for the same place. You'll see your daddy and Tifa again. Oh, God. Soon? That's very Soon ominous. Soon enough, Marlene. Soon enough. Very, very ominous. Curious on the bandwagon. <laughs> you wasn't it hmm. hello in there That's interesting. So Aerith being present in all manners of the live stream and aware of everything seemed to be the case. That's what I was thinking in, in Remake. The Aerith resolution and remake? It's not our Aerith, but you know, Aerith Welcome in the live stream. To the village of the oh, what the fuck? You're just gonna leave us here now? Ooh, Aerith weapon. Oh shit, Aerith only has five weapons? Oh my god, don't tell me there's an enemy I had to steal shit from. Or her in this one, ATB Ward and Lustre Shield. Are you saying Aerith knows all of the Zack scenes and what's going on right now? Uh, maybe not this Aerith. But the live stream Aerith, the one that's like in tune with everything that people are rumored and I, I even think it as well. There's an Aerith from the original FF7 
that's the one that's interacting with Cloud in the live stream and the, the dream sequences and stuff. I think that's the ultimate, like, Aerith. Aerith Prime. Welcome to our domain, children of the planet. <laughs> Y'all hear that just now? Our flesh is gone. Yet our spirits are condemned to linger. Outsiders such as we are unwelcome, forever denied the planet's embrace. I feel for you. Can only imagine how tough that's been. My kin now dwell within these effigies. I beseech you, lend them your ears. Long have the Cetra been oppressing the Gi? I feel like that's what they're alluding to here. Like the Cetra, the Gi are obviously having a way bigger role right now in this. Just like how You're Wutai has a way bigger to role. The planet, and so she rejects them because you have to come from the life stream to return to it. Which means these dudes can't die, right? <laughs> They're invincible! I'm not sure that's something to celebrate. Being stuck as spirits with no hope of release sounds like a fate worse than death. As if you know anything about dying. Uh, I mean, are you even really alive? <laughs> <laughs> Another stuck spirit, perhaps? We shall not rest till the materia is ours. You and me both. <laughs> we shall not rest so the materia is ours. They just keep talking. Person. God damn it. Damn, son. Materials are leveling up. I also need to get some stuff off of red. I've heard this voice before. This singer sung a song, a vocal song in, in Remake. I think it was a comedy song they sang. <laughs> the Happy Turtle? It sounds like the singer that sang the Happy Turtle song. That first strike on, right? Yep. That back on Tifa, god damn it.
All right, what can I give Cloud? He's got that. I could give Tifa Skill Master, I think. This is definitely the Happy Turtle guy. Thank you guys for the 47 likes, man. I appreciate it. That's the voice. It was our fate to be spurned by the planet forevermore. Thus did we resolve to forge our own path to salvation. With materia, you mean? We long to lay hands on the materia of peace. Materia of peace. That holy materia. This air is holy materia is not working. Oh shit, I didn't play ATV boost on people. What the fuck, bro? It's behind you. This area really looks like it's like a blend of the cave and the OG. They extended the shit out of this chapter. The Yuffie's running straight for the materia of peace. Yuffie, they don't have it. They wouldn't be asking for us to get it if they had it. Our ultimate salvation is cessation. It is nothingness. Our wish is not to exist, but rather to no longer exist. Ultimate salvation is nothingness? The purest. Alright, I feel like it's way too obvious to be holy materia then. Although it would explain the conflict with them and the Cetra. Right? Because the Cetra held on to the holy materia and they needed it. But they didn't want them to use it for their own corruption uh, corrupting gain. Don't know about y'all, but I got a sinking feeling. I think we probably don't want to overstay Well, they want a materia to like kill them basically because they can't die. Only desire is death. And if the planet won't let them have it, well, who's to say they won't let the planet have it? Save uh, me! Sure. <laughs> don't you think someone responsible like me ought to hang on to that materia so it doesn't fall into the wrong hands? I think we shouldn't get involved at all, Lassie. A little late for that. My god, he's so creepy. What do you think he wants us to do for him? Steeped in our one desire, purest of material in the world, with pain and spite, they lack the 
steeped in our one desire. Bro. Purest of material and no more. With pain and spike made black. Steeped in our one desire. Purest of material and no more. With pain wow. and spike made black. They want the black material to kill themselves with it. Yeah, peace as in rest in peace. Whatever that materia is, we can't let them have it. No matter how much they want it. Can't he hear you? I don't know how far we can let this go, but for now we play along. Oh God, Sephiroth, plaguing Cloud's mind. Give me the black materia, Cloud. Everybody wants the black materia, bro. Oh shit, you're healing them? Huh, they had a sorcerer. Yi sorcerer, he was uh, rezzing them. It's confused, I'm like, wait. How are you coming to life? Also, by the way, Arise is a spell in this? What if we got re-raise? Those not born of the life stream can never join its flow. One cannot return to that from which one Damn. did not arise. And so our souls sought refuge here. Yet idleness brought You think it's no a trick solace. to give it to Sephiroth? Our oh, like Sephiroth's impersonating them? ...imposed by the planet for the sin of our existence. And now, our only wish is to be freed from this prison. To be granted true release. Wow. This is a whole new plot point. The Gi was not this involved in FF7 OG at all. I wasn't expecting all this shit. From the planet, we claim the greatest of materia, a most sacred treasure, and imbued it with our desire for freedom. After an eternity, the materia began to stir, and thus did we rejoice, knowing that salvation was within our grasp. We rejoiced, so convinced were we that our prayers for release had not been in vain. Yet the loathsome Cetra trespassed upon our lands and stole the treasure that would grant us deliverance. Therefore, we ask that you retrieve it, the Black Materia, key to our oblivion. Please, it alone can liberate us from this endless dream. The Gi cannot rest until our sacred treasure. I feel like if we give them the black materia, us. they would also summon Meteor. The Meteor would destroy the planet, Moreover, which in turn would destroy in them. Addressing the crime of her ancestors, the Cetra may help us to let go our ancient grudge. Yo, Timo, have a good night, dude. Where is it? It is said the orb lies within a place of Cetra worship. A place of Cetra worship or temple. You know what? 
I have an idea. At least, I think I do. Forgive me, Hollow One, if I regard you with suspicion. <laughs> Shit, now, bro. hold on there. I'm friend to one and all, thanks to my crystal ball. No matter your need, I have the right read. <laughs> Strange, but you can trust him. Really. But can we, Cloud? It appears we have been discovered. <laughs> They're shooing I it away. Trust you will return our materia to its right. The Cetra sound like they were kind of like bullies, like bad guys. Only you can end our torment. So these guys want the black materia. Sephiroth wants the black materia, and the Cetra have been hiding the black materia. Which, as we know from the original game, the black materia is the temple itself. Huh? I guess we're back? Yeah. Oh, this is Cosmo's cave area we in the daytime. Moving. Right. I'll make you proud, Dad. Just wait. I can't help but feel a little sour. Like, that was a really cool story inclusion, but it happened way too quick. Like, he literally, the music didn't even finish playing for Red to, like, stop talking to his dad. Like, this was impactful, yeah, but I feel like they kind of ruined it for me personally. They cut it out way too quick and jumped into this whole another thing. Yeah, better explanation for going to the temple, that's right. Especially since we're not going to Rocket Town to get shot down and then go and stumbling across a, reg a random house <laughs> and then getting the keystone from there. Or keystone information from there. I agree, Lynx. I think Ginatak should have showed up after they walked back here and went into the... to see you again. The cave. Allow me to escort you to fellow Bugenhagen. Please, this way. Uh, listen, bro. You telling me there's a shortcut on that side that we could have been taken? We'd have to go through this stupid ass trial. Now, don't get me wrong. I I loved seeing the Seto scene. I think it was great. I was really excited to see it, but I wanted the moment to be a little bit more impactful towards the end, and they kind of I feel like they kind of robbed me of that a little bit by inserting the Gina talk plot point for the black materia instantly right there. I feel like it didn't have to be instantly done right there. They could have waited a little bit. Dude, the music here is great. Hookline <laughs> and sinker. Those undead suckers actually think we're gonna give them back their materia. They called it their salvation or whatever. But to me, it sounded more like something with the potential to wreak some serious havoc. Nope. No way in hell are we letting him have it. Can't let him have it either. Him? Sephiroth. Did no one else sense him? No. You're the resident expert. If you say Sephiroth was there, I'll believe you. Wait, wait, wait. So, are you saying Sephiroth's after the Black Materia too? Probably. Better to assume he is. Well, come on! Let's go, let's go! Can't let anyone get between me and my Materia! So, Kitsa, I gotta ask, how do you know about the Cetra Temple anyway? Uh, well, like, uh, I wouldn't say I know about it exactly. Not directly, anyway. What's that supposed to mean? I just recall some document or other discussing its existence. If we can get to a Shinra terminal, I should be able to find it again. Terminal, huh? They set any up here? I think so. But I bet old Boogie will know for sure. Boogie. Old Boogie. I want to hear the song for a little bit. It's pretty good. Hey, what's up, Chaos? You're in Chapter 12? Nice. Hey, 
that's two emotional moments they kind of cut a little bit earlier guys if i'm not lying because i feel like they did cut um barrett and dine a little bit earlier because in the og barrett and dine have their moment it's emotional impactful and then it cuts to black and then it it shows in the essence of time things pass and then barrett and then they go up to do the uh the chocobo race which isn't what happens it actually happens in reverse this moment they kind of did a similar thing where they just immediately moved into something else because like when dine passed away uh after that moment like almost immediately cloud and them jump we jump into a boss fight so we the player can't really grieve barrett gets his moment alone the entire time barrett's alone with him we see him change positions and lay dine down down to like uh to, to bury him or whatever but we the player need that little that little moment too man you're alive i feared you might have returned to the planet oh, we did on. but we didn't we both know you didn't need to worry about me after all i am the son of seto the watcher forgive me but if i recall correctly shinra should have set up a transmission terminal here in cosmo canyon so where is it oh well, what did become of that thing Ah, yes. Now I remember. I was so fascinated by the technology it employed, uh, I did some tinkering. Some tinkering, I say, though it was quite a lot. But now it serves a decidedly more practical purpose. You've got to be kidding me! <laughs> uh, well, do you know about a Setra temple? A temple, you say? If you mean a place where they worshipped gods, none exist. The Setra never engaged in such practices. I didn't know that. Maybe it was referred to as such by someone ignorant of their culture. If instead it is a site of importance to the Setra that you seek, texts do speak of one, and of the pains taken to conceal it. So, it does exist? Oh, ho, ho, ho. Perhaps, though I know not where it is. Huh? And even should you find it, I would urge caution. They were a star-crossed people. To follow in their footsteps is to court tragedy. <sighs> However, the rewards may yet outweigh the risks. The graphics mode looks so you good. You must bring every one of your senses to bear. For then no secret will elude you. However well hidden. And when you return home, I hope you'll share your discoveries with me. Fellow Bugenhagen! What is it? I'm a little busy here. Another man in a black robe has come. What should we do? Well now, a friend of yours? Where'd you see him? Oh, uh, the village gate. We should check it out. Yeah. You're red dick riding his dad now. His dad's probably like, hey, you wasn't with me shooting in the gym. I'm joking. I'm sorry. Hey, after all, I'm the son of Sato. Yeah. Uh, I suppose I ought to seal the door once again. I'm going back. Just kidding. Oh, these guys like a fast travel. Of the planet be upon you. Are you in need of guidance? Is the thing boogie on the materia? Yeah, he's sitting on a big fat materia. I think I did everything here. We did all the Queen's blood matches. Oh, what the hell? Nanaki. Yo, how did this guy make it up is here? This man okay? He is, albeit rather weak. I'm not sure why though. I know Mako poisoning when I see it, and this isn't it. ain't that. Pratifa and I grew up. Ah, oh, of course. Nibelheim has a terminal. I bet my whiskers on it. Okay, so this is how we go to Nibelheim. 
It, uh, had a terminal. Cloud, remember when you told Gein attack back there? That might be weird, but you can trust me. Hey, well, even if you were lying, I'm gonna prove to you that you can trust me. That I'm on your side. It's not that. We should go. Hey! Wait, <laughs> you're talking about heading to Nibelheim from here? There's no roads you can take far as I know. Maybe we can't go by land. Hmm. But by air. Meaning we'll need smoke. Right Free smoke! Then. Back to the airstrip we go. We gotta send up some smoke, chat. Get started on the proto relic now. Davi told us that uh, it was it was worth it, especially the Cosmo one. So we could go ahead and do that. Let's get these side quests real quick. I am curious to see which what are what are they. Look out for the Sid High Winds. I don't know if I want to do these. We spent a lot of time in Cosmo Canyon yesterday. I think I just I think I would rather do the um proto relic and then at the end of the game before we wrap things up, we'll come back and we'll knock out all the side quest stuff and we'll have like a dedicated stream for like side mission stuff so this way people can know to like they don't have to worry about spoilers and that type of deal, you know. This is chapter 10, Blue Charizard. Side missions are worth it here too? Oh my god. Bro, yesterday's VOD that I recorded is like five hours of Cosmo Canyon like side stuff before we even started this story. That's gonna be brutal when I upload that. Because we did every single side mission here. Oh, not side mission, sorry. Side um, content exploration detail. To go around. Let's see. Or I'll smash up. Oh my god, Cloud Sky with the five gift memberships, dude. Smashing them indeed. Thank you so much for getting us closer to our goal. I was on the other side, okay. So then we could just it might be faster if I Well, let's just walk. Let's just walk it. Just do the most important one, at least. What's the uh, most important side quest, then? I'll open up the menu, and you guys uh, will we'll direct. You can direct me to it. Oh, it is way down there. Shit. <laughs> Cloud Sky, no problem, man. I'm glad you guys enjoy the streams. I really am glad. It's gonna be up there for show. The one for Boogie and the one after it. Oh god. <laughs> That's both of them. This song. I see you're approaching the signal. The source appears to be somewhere in the canyon's ruins. Somewhere in the planet's wait, wait, wait. ruins. <laughs> Are all Proto Relic quests Yuffie and Red related? My precious material, where are you? 
down. No need to be shy, come out. You see, gonna take you home. No fucking way. Yuffie! Nayo! Hulk! Billy Bob! No shot. It's so good to they see They made you. it? You too. We were worried you might not have made it out in time. Nothing can kill this bloom. <laughs> Clearly. Hmm? Say, where's Sonon? Um... Here. Hey, you three! <gasps> Splinter Cell. Where are my manners? These guys are from Avalanche HQ. They're the ones who helped me out back in Midgar. And I don't think they need an introduction. Y'all were at the Shinra building, weren't you? Tell me. Was Wedge with you? Or did you see him? <sighs> if you can tell me anything, anything at all, please. Wedge, he... I'm sorry. Don't be. Just, I need to know. After the Sector 7 plate fell, the things we saw and heard, all the carnage, it was hell. We wanted to help, we really did. But how? It all seemed so hopeless. That's when the call came, from the folks at Avalanche HQ. We learned it was the company that dropped the plate. And that they were gonna drop another, unless we stopped them. HQ needed volunteers to help storm the Shinra building. This was our chance. We knew it was the right thing to do. All of us. Wedge and I what? ended up being assigned to the same truck. <sighs> We'll infiltrate the building via the underground parking facility. From there, we make our way up, taking each and every floor. We've lost contact with Lucia's team. I think Lucia? We have to That's enough. First, we'll check in with Matt. On Matt? What? <laughs> They're alive? Let me just scooch on over. Here? I'm Wedge with the Splinter Cell. Uh, Barrett's crew, right? This is a side quest, bro. Here, what? Try one of these. It'll help you calm down. Thank you. Holy shit! So yeah, the first soldier characters—they're working with Avalanche. Go on, eat up. And seemingly alive at this point of the story, at least. That actually looks pretty good. I want one. Our team was heading upstairs to take out the president. I know what you're thinking. Avalanche doesn't do that. But when the plate fell, the rules changed. <laughs> Come on, man. Get the lead out. Don't want to be left behind. Hey, thanks for the assist. I wouldn't stand there, bro. Bro, your hand is in the All danger right, zone. Almost there, boys. At long last, we're gonna take back our world, find the bastards who stole it, and send them to hell. Yeah. yeah. I've got friends up there who need to know we're coming. Oh, uh, sorry, but I didn't want them to get hurt, sir. <laughs> Go, I'll catch up. Right. We were all fired up, ready to fight. Yeah, this is when he gives a transmission to Barrett and them.
Oh my I god. Believe it. it was him. Thank you. <laughs> Damn it. Don't worry. It's all good, bro. Huh? Hey, y'all heard that, right? That was weird. Barrett, those who pass on become one with the live stream. I know what you thought you heard, but it was probably just the wind. <sighs> Whatever. In times past, the Cetra came to fonts like these. Holy to shit, that was good. Stream. There aren't many left, so we wanted to help preserve the few still standing. Kind of crazy but that in remake they gave him an off-screen you know? death like that, but they at least he showed it to us here. Hey, Barrett, why don't we give them a hand? Help them spruce things up. There anything we can do for you? I don't know. Restore the planetary fonts? I want to see Tifa yeah, and Nayo interact. Source of energy. And kind of like relief valves for the life. Is nerdy Tifa chat? But when they're as busted as this one here, you can't even get close to do repairs. Mako's way too dense. Yeah, this so is technically a side mission, but a really well done one. All the side missions are really well done, but damn. Wally! Thing is, little guy's just too old. Probably better off in a junkyard than with us. Perhaps I can be of service? Robotics is one of my areas of expertise. Meet <laughs> Robot Chadley. <laughs> Or Robo Chat, if you prefer something abridged. At Robo any rate, Chat. You should now have complete control over him. Go on, ask him to do something. The Mark IV from MGS4. Wow, man. They actually showed like Wedge's like thud of his body when he hit the floor. At least the live stream spoke to Barrett. Damn, though, man. I mean, it makes sense how he dies like that, because uh, in the OG game, he does die not immediately from the fall off of the tower, but he dies, has a few words with Aerith and Tifa, and then and then he, well, he falls, hits the ground, has a few words with Aerith and Tifa, and then dies. Convinced that robot was a worthless hunk of junk. Turns out, I just didn't know how to use him. Fiends are drawn to places with an excess of Mako. We just have to hope they don't get in our way. Oh, sorry. Do you mind if I rest my eyes for a bit? I haven't been <laughs> Chad sleeping too good since. Well, you know. The whispers were pushing his ass down, bro. You saw that? The whispers were were a menace. They were sending him to the shadow realm, one way or another. Restore the fonts. Oh. We, had, we saw another one of these in the upper area, so I'm glad we went there. We could fast travel to it. In Gears and Gambits, you must program robots with gambits in action and send them into battle with the aim of reaching the center of the spring and vanquishing the enemy leader. This is a mini game? Emerging Victorious will restore the planetary font. Oh. Uh, sure? I never... I, had ne I have not even heard about this one. Gears and Gambits prepare for battle. Three types of robots can be deployed, each operating in accordance with its gambits in action, which are programmed prior to battle. Gambits determine a target. Action, by the way, Final Fantasy 12 reference. Actions determine what the robot will do with that target. For the first battle, let's use the AI set by Chadley. Hybrid, so the offensive loadout doesn't have a heal. But it has combat and aeroga, and the defensive has a heal and a shield. Sure. Robots can be deployed for any of the three portals and will move along their lane towards the enemy center and the lead. leader in the center. X to view each available robot's gambits and actions. Close to gauge. Try to deploy robots that can exploit these vulnerabilities. Okay, so lightning. A 
I feel like there's a lot of shit here. This actually looks like the Final Fantasy XII, like, battlefield, doesn't it? I feel like this is just going to be inevitable, so... Oh my god. Did quite a lot of damage. It's like a tower defense game. It pretty much is. Boss HP low. Advanced actions of their own. Such enemy by the one. Oh, the music picked up. Shit. So that one's a fire. Interesting. Why the hell did they get so close? Come on, guys. One hit. Just one hit it. Why did you have to get so close to do that? All right, I get it. It's not as complicated. I feel like the word complication explaining it is like uh, a little bit more complicated, but this isn't too bad. How would you say the pacing of this game is? Is it too slow or just right? It's however you want it to be, to be honest. So far from what I gather, it's like, wow. if you want the story, you can it's go ahead and just the do the story. See this. Who says they're not? <laughs> What's that? I believe that light will lead us to another set of ruins. <laughs> and another font to fix too, I'll bet. Is it okay if we tag along? Sure, why not? Whatever beef I've got with you HQ kids, the planet's welfare takes priority. Uh, probably not gonna fast travel. Just so we can get this dialogue. But yeah, like, the game's side content can be skipped in certain ways. And even, like, there's people that complain, and this this really annoys me. People complain and bitch about Queen's Blood on the boat, saying how it's unskippable. It's totally fucking skippable. You're just fucking stupid, and you didn't listen to what they said when they said you could drop out of the tournament at any time if you talk to the person on the right. You could totally do that. That person's there the entire time on the right. You don't have to play Queen's Blood. You're just bitching for no fucking reason. So anybody that brings up that argument is a fucking dumbass. And I sound angry because I am. Like, I've heard people complain about that before the game came out. And even till this day after the game came out. People complain that you can't skip this shit in my videos. And it's annoying. Queen's Blood is great. I like it. But I get it. If you don't like it, don't be an idiot. You can fucking skip it if you don't want to. Don't fucking lie and say that you can't skip it. It's unskippable. That's stupid. It's not true at all. And it's fucking dumb. You can't see how people don't like Queen's Blood. I mean, people don't like card games, and I get it, but like, to be just flat out blindly saying that <laughs> it's unskippable and it's ass and it's trash, it's, it's stupid. The pace around here is a lot more laid back than the hustle and bustle of Midgar. Honestly, I could get used to this. The planet is incredible. <laughs> Wedge must have been one hell of a cook. Wish we could have talked more. Damn. Are they gonna be walking around with us? 
That'd be kind of cool. Nah, I don't think so. Oh, and you say to use this already. Shit, I didn't even notice it. I'm like trying to over here use it, and I'm like, why isn't it going? He was so addictive, you started chapter 13, and you're 80 hours in, still got a lot of side quests to do. Nice. Get it all in there, you know? Well, I guess since Nayo and them aren't going to follow us in the field, which I guess would have made, you know, it would have been a lot to like... <laughs> Implement and do. We could just fast travel to wherever the next one is, which is. Yep, this one that I've been to. From my study of ancient texts. What's up, Weaver? Playing on dynamic. Built by the Cetra to house something alien. Precisely what is unclear. I remember hearing about this growing up. You don't think they were talking about the Gi, do you? Yeah, Donzo, I saw that too. Perhaps. The yellow rocks. The We've been memeing them. Otherwise. Anytime we see rocks that aren't yellow, we get angry. I surmise these structures were designed How dare these rocks not be yellow? For now, let's continue to restore them. To reverse trigger them. I'm sure we'll find something within. The planet itself is guiding us. I've also developed an additional AI chip for Exactly, Azaleo. Hopefully this game is designed for you to play it however you want to play it. Whether you want to do the side quests or not. You don't have to. I just think that if you do do the side quest, the game's impact will hit you a little bit more. In the best possible ways. Like, it's not an L for doing- I don't think you- I don't think it can be an L doing these side quests. Play Gears and Gambits. Years of war gambits. A lot of people do want to expend uh, energies being upset. I didn't use any of these skills. Should totally do that this time. Oh god, wow, it actually does get more complicated. I didn't need to do that. It's got a crown. I am a hacker. Get it right. I am a hacker. Dang. I guessed wrong.
for robots in lane. Damn. AoE. This kind of does like have some queen, not queens, uh, what's it called? Um, Fort Condor elements to it, which is interesting. Oh my God. Oh my God. <laughs> Oh, I should have put him at the fire. I didn't notice. I thought these two were like unelemental. Unelementable. My health crystal. No oh, chat. They're after my minerals. They crave my minerals. Oh my god, we only have 30 seconds. Hey, fuck ass bot. Go and attack. Damn, I'm gonna lose. 10 seconds. I used Comedia or whatever and it didn't seem like it did any damage. That's annoying. Give me overtime. I shouldn't have used that so early, but YOLO. Be a little bit more hyper aggressive here. Did it not hit the uh, the boss? I don't think it did. I 
think I was using the recommended one, but I swapped in some cure stuff as well. But that might be messing me up. I feel like Laria is uh, kind of ass. Oh, well, it's good right there. They're targeting the boss with melee. I think I need to switch that. Is it possible to switch that to a range attack? Because, like, dude, there's no way I could... Yeah, because look, the foe... Weak to an element, they're using Thundershot. But foe, they're using Lariat. And Lariat's melee, and that's, like, that's fucking them up. Because it's taking too long for them to get in. And also causing me to lose. I can't use these. Oh, a missile. That might be better. Oh, I don't have any more missiles. Oh, can I buy more? So if you use fire shot four times, all they have left is Lariat. What else we got? Uh, ally. They can only cure a shot once. That's not even. I don't think that's worth it. Save the Regenica for when they're all like around them. It does harder AoE attacks if you pop too many in one lane. I'll be sure to. Oh, yeah, the other third one should get Lariat. Yeah, okay. 
way he can use an attack. I had them using self stuff, but I felt like they weren't using it and it was also slowing me down for some reason. I don't know. Right, let's see. These bots start off with the litning. Curious. It does hit the boss. Okay. I finally saw it do, do some damage. Didn't look like it was before. Okay, this is looking like it's a lot going a lot better. I'm sorry, itching. All right, this is looking to be way better. This is absolutely way better. That configuration was way better. <laughs> Just like I, sp I spread them around too. Good tip, chat. Good tip. We all talked about coming out to see the canyon one day. That night at the bar, remember? Yeah. You guys were trying some new cocktails for me. Remember I said uh, I thought these were all just... Yep. Yuffie in red. This now look at it. Jesse dialogue. I'm cutting you off. <laughs> Lightweight. Come on. One more couldn't hurt. Now me, I'm a Cosmo Canyon guy. Mm, that one was pretty good, but it was missing that special flourish. Guess what I got? Huh? Ta-da! Cosmo Salt! Can't call it a Cosmo Canyon without a touch of local flavor, right? Trust me, a dash of this will make all the difference. That's not a dash. What's Cosmo about it? It's mined from the canyon itself, the birthplace of planetology, and pretty hard to come by, I'll have you know. Wow, this is cool. Oh my god. That cell's gotta be laced with something. Wow! <laughs> You're right! Wow! It's like a whole new drink. Man, Tifa lied to that bartender. Stuff is so hard to come by. If only I had more. I thought you might say that. But out the whole store so you can keep on mixing. Wow. Well, those only last us so long. Especially if this Cosmo Canyon becomes a hit. Gonna need to stock up. Tifa told the guy just any salt. What about a trip to the source, huh? We could all bring back as much salt as we could carry. What do you say? Count me in. 
Listen, home of planetology, here we come! It's gonna be great! Oh, really? Huh? Y'all think we got money to be taking field trips? Cause our books say otherwise. <laughs> Barrett was sitting there the whole time. Here. Y'all are just too much. <laughs> Shit, we gotta go. <laughs> Look, guys. Yeah, here. salt in cocktails, around cocktails. Would have liked to have gotten here sooner. It's all a thing. But... Wait, you fixed it already? Ages ago, slow folks. Come on, double time. Coming. <laughs> There's another one. I'm surprised we haven't seen any uh any Gilgamesh show up here. Barrett's big on tough love, huh? Maybe I ought to try to return the favor. Don't don't do that, sir. Don't, don't even try. There's apparently a thriving salt industry here. Back before everything went to hell with the fall of the Republic. Wait, salt comes from the sea, right? Does that mean this whole place used to be underwater? Wow. The planet's just full of surprises. Seeing these ruins, I can't help wondering what this place must have looked like when it was first built. Never imagined I'd get this invested, but here we are. Seeing these ruins, Never imagined I'd get this invested, but here we are. Tifa theme. All right, the next one is oh, back here. Do 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 do. <laughs> salt from salt water, boy, you stupid as hell. How are your name, Billy Bob? Oh, no way. They beat me here? So what the... Chugga will be teleporting, man. There you are. Well, well, y'all beat us to the punch for once. Not that it mattered. We still can't reach the font, and there's a weird fiend. Got any smart ideas? Kill he skunt. Dang. <laughs> I have a subway sandwich. I kind of want to go get it. I've prepared an additional AI chip. It should allow you to progress further. Just mind the monsters. Bee ba ba ba. Bee ba boo boo bee bop boo boo bop. My favorite song. This is the third string in this proto relic quest right here, but I think there's one. There's one chain per region. I feel like I'm going to leave it at what I was doing before. King Juan changes its elemental affinity and weakness upon losing HP. Uses different magic. Okay, so. Uses potent abilities when attacked by several robots. My boy. We coming for that AS. Ya bitch. Shit, they got projectiles now. What's the next one gonna be?
Why isn't it focusing on the enemy in front of it? Yeah, these ones aren't attacking it. You need to add more protocols to it. This one has fire shot, but it's not using the fire shot, which is weird. Oh, I didn't check to see if I got any extra ones. Yeah, I think it's moving fast. Yeah, we had added some, but we removed them and the last match went off without a hitch. But this one, they're clapping them up. Look, he's... The enemies are just... I mean, my things are just targeting the boss. They're just skipping the enemies. Kind of weird. You fucking bitch. It's like prioritizing the boss. Oh, it needs to be hit with air attacks. Shit. Missiles, this one. Okay. Yeah, this one didn't even get an attack off. Oh my god, this one's gonna be kind of rough. Alright. I meant to click triangle to keep me in the menu. I think Charlie said he added something, so let's see. So more air attacks. Okay, I have two of those. Nice. What's the airborne priority? Can't hit them with the lariat. Yeah, that one side, they, they brought out a bunch of like uh, weak enemies to fire and ice so i guess i'll have gravity shot on them too hmm hey john how's it going this might be good all right so that makes sense i'm like why are these enemies dying and it's because they're air enemies i need it the air attacks Which, uh, this one's got. Oh, it knocks it out of the air, I see.
produce a hundred of them. Build a very cheap bot with missiles and produce a hundred of them. How'd you produce a hundred of them? What? Wait, you're talking about like item transmuter? Like, can I go, can I like go craft shit there? Or was there an in-game shop here that I missed? We're still in Cosmo Canyon. There are some gambits or whatever that make these spots cheaper by reducing their HP. I think that's what I'm going to need. Because this is getting kind of brutal. Ice. It's ice now. Shit, I'm gonna die anyways. There's cost reduction protocols. Yeah, we're gonna need that. Modify HP and cost. You think I'll, Chai, you think I'll be good with the minus 20? Oh, there's only one. Still might be good. One with the minus 40. I didn't want to do that. All right, cool. I guess that that might be all that I can do right now. And it should make a difference. There's no more, yeah. There's only boost costs, and oh, there's there is a raise HP. This one, the T1 robot. I could I could raise the HP. There's no negative to this. Doesn't raise the cost. Make the cheapest one with the missiles. Good tip. Yeah, but now I'm thinking like this is free this not that one. Well yeah, this one. I think this one this one's free, so I'm like wondering if I should just throw this on to the same one. So it has decent HP still, even though it costs less. I feel like there's no negative there. Or is there? Alright, immediately this made a big difference.
not make a hundred of them. I should have saved that for when it spawned in more enemies. Guys, yeah, made a huge difference. Thanks, Sad. Thank you, thank you very much. Yeah, this game mode's kind of eh. It has elements of Fort Condor within it. Is he healing? ice right now. Weak to ice. My god. Not dealing enough damage. Okay, there we go. Yes, thank you, chat. Yeah, I'd rather play for Condor myself. <laughs> yeah, we could have done that faster if we just started spamming it. Okay. This is actually the first like proto relic quest line we've completed. Think that did the trick? Yeah, this font's good to go. Man, we really are dead weight, aren't we? Just slowing you down. Yeah, bitch. Blessings of the planet be Wedge is less dead weight, and he's actually dead. <laughs> and has a lot of weight. And what about you, my dear child? What truth have you to tell us this night? Really, guys? Me? You, a resident gourmand. Come on, let's hear it. <laughs> <laughs> um, well, I guess... Uh, Can't hear you. The, the truth is... Uh, uh, the truth is, I just want to do more for you guys. I'm sick of feeling like dead weight around here. Damn. I just, I... For the love of God, not this again. Come on, out with it. Which one of us said that? You. Was it me? Biggs? Or was it... <gasps> no, nobody said anything, honest. But you never would. You guys are too nice for that. You really think she's too nice? <laughs> I'm nice to those who deserve it. See? What did I tell you? Uncle! Uncle! <laughs> Seriously, we wouldn't be here without you. Huh. Was always down on himself. Even though he shouldn't have been. Wedge worked harder than any of us. That's just who he was. Always trying to do better. Yeah. Yeah. That's the only line Cloud said. If only he'd stuck to looking after his cats and enjoying good food. Let's go. Oh, it's one more. There's one more and we'll finish up this area. He's only nice to those she's thirsty for. <laughs> That's what Jairus wishes. Wait, let's talk, talk to them. Don't miss the dialogue. I think the little guy would be able to take down Fiend so easily. But after seeing what he can do, I'm glad he's on our side. We're glad for the help, but it's starting to feel like we're the ones providing you support. 
We're trying to. I know my life has a purpose, but what? Yeah, this guy's depressed. He needs some sleep. Some sleep, my boy. How do I get to this? I'll climb up here. From the ancient baths. I'm assuming. I'm assuming this all connects. It kind of looks like it. Maybe not. It absolutely does not connect. Yeah, it, yeah. How come Yuffie didn't ask about GGA? He's still sending them pigeons around at people. I know this. Maybe I have to fly over into the deaths area. Maybe. Yeah, we're still in Cosmo. We getting high. Oh, it could be here. This locked door, I mean, it would make sense. Really? What is this spot for? What have I not unlocked here? I think I have to go up here. Oh, that's for another side quest? Son of a fuck face. Stupid Bokucho. stairs right there don't talk about it chat don't talk about it. don't talk about it bro leave me alone don't bully me motherfucker i was just here all right do i have to be here for this i don't know i actually don't know Language. What is that? This thing right here. It's a higher spot elevator. Budge. Uh, so that. Let me see. I have a glide point nearby here, I think. No, I don't. Oh, I'm thinking about here. I have a lot of glide points over there. Need to go up there. Did I don't I not have that one? Oh, that's odd. 
I could have sworn I walked up here and I went to each one and was unlocking them. I feel about a sales number, but the sale number for Japan on this game, to be honest, is the best Final Fantasy has been. And I hopefully, whatever that sale number is, won't affect part three. I don't think it will. It's PlayStation in general, consoles are not a, a big thing in Japan anymore. I mean, if you think about it, I mean, that's only the Japanese numbers reflecting that. But Elden Ring sold way less than that in Japan. Sorry, guys. We still don't know why Aerith... I mean, because Sephiroth opened that portal for us, and Aerith... cleansed it. Because fuck that. I ain't walking... If Sephiroth opens a portal for me, I ain't walking through that shit. Fuck that. Sephiroth can suck on these. No, this game's only on PS5. I think unlike 16 though, this game's gonna continue to sell and put up big numbers week after week. The more people get into it, the more word of mouth. Because the game has really high ratings from both users and critics. And that's all it really needs at the end of the day. Game's gonna put up crazy numbers. Honestly, they did miss out on an opportunity by not doing a uh, promo for the Super Bowl. They should have totally did that. I don't know what Square Enix was not thinking, but hey, that's the situation they're in. It reviewed well. It's gonna sell well, and plus we're just looking at J Japanese physical. Where I'm pretty sure this game sold a lot more digitally. Remember how many physical copies were lost in the mail and people ended up buying more digital copies on top of that? Like, there's at least five people in this chat that have bought the game twice because their physical collectors took too long and then they ended up buying the digital. So if you don't own a PS5, you straight up can't play this game? I mean, for now, yeah. When they release it on PC, you will. Oh my god, I came back to the same fucking spot. Chat, I am confusion. That's actually insane. I don't think they'd be able to optimize this game enough so that it could run on PlayStation 4. I don't think Square Enix would ever be able to do that. I'm angry, I want to fight you. 
Combo came out backwards. Not bad. Let's see what else they got around here. I mean, if you ask me, I'd prefer for this game to not be exclusive. I'd rather be available on everything. But that's between Square Enix and Sony. Yeah, according to the trailer, it said this is exclusive on PlayStation 5 until May 29th, so look forward to maybe in June we get more information on that. my controller i'm not inputting i am not inputting that twice but it's registering that i'm doing double dive kicks can't find that elevator i had to take this i took this flight path right here and I hovered straight over the mountain, which you're not supposed to do. It looks like you're supposed to fly from here to here. But I said, fuck that. I went up this one and flew it right up right here. And I was able to get to it from here. They got kidnapped. All right, let's see what new shit we got. This game is long, bro. Long. Especially if you're trying to 100% everything. They got a lot of good shit in here. Did that raise the cost? It did. No, it didn't.
Give me a breast augmentation. This is a new mini game. I was trying to save that one. Fuck. Yeah, it's getting triggered. Dang, it healed. Oh, fuck all that. I make the first one only on the four because they started development in 2015 and if they wanted to start developing on the five would you rather them do it or stop it and delay another two or three years when i die will i return to the live stream too given what i am why is Yuffie all the way up there? Well, yeah. Why wouldn't you? Oh. What's that? A gift Wedge left behind for us. Listen, I just... Uh, I want to say thanks. You all being here, it helped. Oh, we... we didn't really do anything. Now that the ruins are fixed, what's next? Actually, I was wondering if maybe... we could... join up with you guys? Wait, you can't be serious. Think about it. We haven't heard Jack from HQ. But these guys are out there making a difference. I know, but... What do you say? We'd be happy to tag along if, uh... And who the hell said you could? People not willing to die for the cause got no place with us. Uh, I'm sorry. I just thought that... Your hearts are in the right place. But y'all... Y'all got a different path to walk. One that's... All your own. Damn, Barrett. I can't eat another bite. Wow, they get a lot of dialogue in this. <clears throat> I suppose it's time for yours truly to say his piece. Here it comes, the grand finale. May the planet guide your words. And keep them brief while she's at it. <laughs> <clears throat> so, the five of us here all came together because we wanted to save this planet of ours. Ain't made much money. Ain't made a lot of friends either. But 
The one thing we do have deep in our hearts is a passion. A fire that burns for the cause. That won't stop burning till Shinra goes up in smoke. The road ahead won't be easy. But I ain't stopping. Cause even if it costs me my life, I'm uh, taking down Shinra uh -huh. and taking back our planet. So if you got the guts, then come with me. I'm hungry after all, for justice. Hi. <laughs> <laughs> you know I'm in. My man. Well, if everyone's feeling it, how about we keep things going with another round? <laughs> Tifa, get me another Cosmo Canyon. Bitch, fix your own drink. That's what I would have told her. <laughs> <laughs> she is the bartender. saying we should forget about them. No way I ever could. But you and me, we gotta stop living in guilt and regret. Damn, Bear looks so good. Yeah. Damn, Tifa looks so good! This is a good side quest arc for them. It really expands on the trauma their characters have gone through. Aw, they sent one up for them. <laughs> Ow! <laughs> Today's a new day, people! So let's not waste it. Come on, y'all. <laughs> <laughs> hey, wait. Forgot this. Here. Trophy! Director of Regional Intelligence. This is my first region that we've 100%ed. The live stream fonts photo relic. Does it automatically turn into the Genji armor? What are we loading here? Tethered soul. Adrift in the void of time, this bridge is make fast. Who are you? Oh, God. Is it a solo fight? The singular item that you now hold is possessed of a power beyond your can. You will deliver it unto me! No. <laughs> ah. Very well. And I shall take it from you by force! <laughs> oh, Cloud. Ah. You are indeed a worthy warrior. I saw it plain. And never does my judgment err. So it comes to this. Bring me! <laughs> okay, he got me. Tricked me. Cloud? Cloud! 
Yes. Oh, thank goodness. I was so worried. You can see each but individual just... strand of Cloud's hair. I was unable to locate you, albeit for only a moment. If something had happened to you because of me, I... Nothing happened. I'm fine. Right. My apologies. I let my emotions get the better of me. <laughs> Rattled you, huh? Could it be you got a soft spot for Soldier Boy here? You the noise response triggered. Cause Barrett's mocking tone of voice. Anyway, don't worry about it. Been in much worse situations than that before. Very well. Regardless, I will do what I can to improve security measures. I need an anime, man. With the Final Fantasy VII character story, I don't give a shit if I've consumed this shit as much as I have. I need another one. I need more. Inspired by proficient programming, Charlie's made some adjustments to his game that offers an increased challenge. I'm gonna tell you right now, Charlie, I don't give one fuck about that. Really? A hard mode for all of them? Yo, Devi, have a great rest of your night, man. I appreciate it. And, uh, well, hopefully the morning is going to go smooth with the sun rising up and whatnot. Okay. All right. So we did all the quests here except for the side quests that are in Cosmo Canyon. I really want to start in Evilheim because I do not want this Cosmo Canyon video to be like 10 hours of just being in Cosmo Canyon. <laughs> Which feels like it will be at this point. But I think we will come back. I think we'll come back to later on. And get it done, chat. For that, we need a good anime studio. Uh, shit. I mean, let's just hit up Mappa. They're doing everything. Might as well. They don't mind being overworked, it seems. Hey, yo, Mappa, let's make a, a Final Fantasy VII anime. Sure. Nibelheim time. Not that you've got a choice, but thank you for choosing Bronco Airlines. Set, my friend. <laughs> you you got a choice. To Nibelheim, could you? A little far. But not too far, I reckon. The old girl should be more than up to the challenge. Nibel airstrip. What's the studio that's animating solo leveling? They're pretty good. Oh wow, look at the different region! So beautiful, Chad. I love it. Hey, these rocks didn't load in. Don't look at that. <laughs> da, 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 da. Look at this overworld of the map. Look at that chat. Oh my god, the reactor. You can see it from here? In the town? Kind of, yeah. That's really impressive. Trophy! Chapter 10 done. Now it's time for chapter 11. Excited. The long shadow of Shinra. I'll see you when I see you. Let's call him back and then leave. Oh. Hey, Sephiroth, wait up. 
Bring me the black materia. Oh. <laughs> oh, just just coming right out with it, I guess. Squeeze him, Tifa. Squeeze him. Looks like we're not the only ones headed for Nibelheim. Huh. Almost like they swung by Cosmo Canyon just so they could lead us here. Sorry, just thinking out loud. Forget about it. Shit, chat. Chapter 11. Hey, rabbits. Remember, there's a mog house next to Nibelheim. These old planes. Let's just call Sid back and not even fly with him. Just piss him off. Sephiroth is not wasting any time. Oh, well, we got to get a chocobo for this region, uh, right? Kate, meant to tell you before, but the terminal's probably gone. Nibelheim burned down five years ago. It did. Uh, not to worry. The terminal's as snug as a bug in a rug. Because Shinra wasn't about to let that facility burn down. Meaning the reactor? Well, that's important too. But no. I'm no expert on Nibelheim, but the manor? What I do know is that it's the only lead we have on that materia. So not much choice. Yeah. It's this or nothing. We should get going. Oh shit, new enemies. I gotta put that accessory back on Cloud. I like the materia being like access like having an accessory for it, so it just frees up a slot. Assess is it does have its uses, especially for like a first playthrough. But I can't I kinda hope that they have like some more crazier ones. Stop apologizing to Naki, it's so cringe. He sounds like, uh, Morty. Oh, jeez, Cloud. Oh, you know, I I'm really sorry, Cloud. <laughs> it's okay, Nanaki. Nanaki, it's okay. Just, just put the seed inside of you, Nanaki. Just put it inside of you. You're old enough. We gotta go on all these adventures. Oh shit, chocobo right off rip. Got a lot of wolf variants in this game. Oh, the very first thing for Nibelheim. Oh, they gave us, this is the first time we came to an area and they gave us a chocobo immediately. Yo bitch ass can wait. Birdie. You have a beautiful birdie. What the fuck is this? Salina. It's not a bra, it's a bustier. Oh my god, Legion. My baby. My boy. What's going on, dude? Thanks for the raid. How are we all doing tonight? We're out here catching bokachos. What are these cactuses? 
Oh, these ain't rocks. These are food. Fuck. I see it. I see what I gotta do. Son of beach. So I just gotta navigate it through the cactuses. Heading to bed, gotta work some we gotta work tomorrow. Yo, thank you very much, Legion. Appreciate appreciate the raid, bro. Dang, that's too far. Man. How close they want me to throw this shit? Chat, anybody? Either in my chat or Legion's chat, any of you guys going to PAX East? Me and Legion's gonna be at PAX East. And we wanna pax you guys. We wanna pax you guys real good. Real, real good. Oh, what the fuck? It walked right into it. Shit. Don't worry, Selena. Eat. Oh my god, is that one gonna inflate and hit her in the ass? No, it won't. Thank God. I was about to be so sad. Please don't tell me I have to restart this for all over again if she gets like hit three times. Okay. Alright. This is literally a chicken side quest. <sighs> Bro, what fresh hell is this for real? Where? Really? <sighs> oh, she's not gonna make it in time. I'm gonna fail. <sighs> Did I not get a checkpoint? Did I not get a checkpoint? What is PAX East? It is March 21st to the 24th. Retry from checkpoint, okay. Alright, that's kind of generous. It did drop all my shit, though. So I need to... I have to get them, like, stand on it. Hands off my Decent checkpoint, I guess. Fucking kidding me, bro. You gotta be fucking kidding me. Serious game? Come on, dude. Fuck, I have to go up there? This thing's the stuff of nightmares.
No! Oh my god, just one more, just one more, just one more. Checkpoint's not that bad. Well, fuck me. Fuck. I think that's a bad spot. my own special hell chat it has been designed for me I gotta get this shit as close as possible to right here you mother bitch it's not gonna make it Wait a few cactuses in the back in front of the field, just lure it to one end or the other. The back? Please tell me you can see this one. Thank God. That's gotta be a good spot. I just saw like a bunch just drop off of there. That's just one. Que. Queef. Que queef. I just realized I have to go down there and get it. Give me that ass, bitch! No wonder they gave us, gave us that one first. Salina! Quick, quick. Quick, chat. Quick, 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 quick. Well, above bodies of water, hold L2 to launch yourself high in the air with a Choco Jet ability. Oh, shit. This one can basically fly over water. Kind of cool that you could still kind of do it there. <laughs> Hoot, hoot, hoot. Oh shit, look at those, uh, those weirdo enemies. The hell is this shit? Tuft of Choco Grass. Shit is gas. Live Spring Owl. Still on performance mode or do I move the graphics? I move the graphics. We 
we move to the graphics mode. This chocobo is pretty sick. Salinas. Guys, we almost got to 100 likes on the YouTube stream. If you haven't yet, please hit that like button. It really helps us out a lot. I appreciate it. Mwah. Oh my god. It always surprises me that they have their shit too. Yeah, you go far with this shit, bro. Like, there's all these, like, things to collect in the air. Yo, hitting hydros. Literally, we're hitting hydros. Hitting switches on the bitches. Fuck, this yo, this region's Odin. Damn, I forgot Odin was in this game. All right, Odin, show me what you got. Hey, what's up, Elise? Be sure to grab any choco grass you see. X circles, X circles. Let's do it. It's a little forgiving. It's a little forgiving. Rob Fell. It's 1133 right now in Alaska. His first time watching Rebirth. Bro, I can't wait for you to play this. And when you finally play it, I hope you let me know. Because I would love to hear it. I managed to extract the necessary data from the crystal. This should Game's allow great, me to strengthen man. your materia. You just lost 67 to 0 in Queen's Blood? Yo, that enemy cooked you, bro. What card were they running? That's some bullshit, bro. I would, I would, I would rage. I would make it my life's mission to troll that NPC as much as possible. Alright, so I'm assuming this stuff is for a uh, side quest. So, yeah, let's, let's go ahead and get it. Wow, this is, yo, this chocobo is awesome. We're hitting switches. I right. <laughs> look at the squad. Damn it, I hit R2. Is this gonna make Nibelheim a very easy to uh, navigate area? Provided I understand and get the controls and not be a scrub. I know. Everybody wants me to make a Queen's Blood tutorial. I'll probably start, I'll probably try to work on something tomorrow. Yo, this chocobo is awesome, bro. According to Where you going? Legend, Odin's Zontetsken is capable of bleeding anything in two. Zontetsken. creation or the time between the seconds. <laughs> you know, not to compare swords, but his might trump yours. Hi, bro. He wasn't saying that when we was crossing swords the other night. I didn't think we would see these enemies. I tried to go straight down to the ground. Just in case. Keep it together. I got it. Nothing to worry about. There's no escape. Keep 
Collect everything in this region chat without going to a single tower. Am I going backwards? Oh no, I came from here. But I feel like the summon thing told. Oh, wait. It's here. The hell do I get up there? Hey, what's up, Zod? Zood. Choco grass. Never had the blue chocobo for this area. It's high key. I I really really like it a lot. It's creating water jets from its feet. Now this looks like a hunt intel area. Oh, this is gonna be this is probably where we're gonna fight that like bot the dragon boss area we call it like is it, you know when you uh get all the um most of the stuff here or most of the life spring intels they bring you to like a dragon boss to fight i feel like that's gonna be where we fight it i see you shoddy hey shoddy what it is if this is blue, my mind's gonna blow at gold level. Gold's gonna do everything, bro. It's gonna be insane. Oh my god, this is so much better than the flying chocobo. I got uh, probably the flying chocobo is my least favorite. This just feels like how flying should be. Like you move, you just hover a little bit and you move fast right after. Like whoosh, whoosh. It is a little sensitive, but I'm sure I got used to it. Hitting hydro switches. I saw a chest there. Whoa, pal, surprise! Do these choco grass respawn? <laughs> I don't know. Man, they really hit this uh, cachet very well. To be honest, I don't know how I found them. 
So spooky. I think they do respawn. I feel like we've been here. No, we were over there. Owl! Let's start using these more. Oh, they don't respawn. There's 50 in total? Ugh. I forget. Dang, so you really should be grabbing them as you go because you just stop and you forget one. I feel like that's random. If you hold R2, it does this like dive bomb speed up. Is that a Chimera enemy over there? Oh, it's more of the Lord Cthulhu rejects. It's something else. Oh, the Nutsack Dragon! That Sephiroth uh, clapped up. Through. I got you now. This Gorgon, that Gorgon, we all Gorgon. Now wait to get two strike back shot. Nothing to it. You for Nibelheim got some depressing looking beaches. Focus. Allow me. One step at a time. Just lost thirty to fifty-four. No. How could they do this to my boy? Do I have to collect all 50 of the Choco Grass for a quest? So which is my favorite chickens now that I have it all? Have them all? This one. <laughs> this one right here. This one feels fun. It feels fun to ride all of them, but like this one's like special. Ability is so good. Okay. I feel like I didn't hear the uh, Chocobo song until now. I just saw an owl. Where'd he go? And the water stays going over there. Shortcut, I see. We got the blue chocobo now. The war's at 35, 45, and 50. Oh. Okay, they have an ass attack. I didn't know that. We can do that. Take that. 
Thanks for the 100 likes, chat. I just saw that. Good <laughs> thing they made the water come out of their feet. Nowhere else. Dive kick. Yeah, I see a lot of streamers not using dive kick as much. Well, I, I, I borderline spam it. I'm not going to lie, but that's because it's so good. And synergy is... If you're not using synergy... Like, I forget about synergy skills, but I'll never forget about synergy. Magic. That's my life. Where are all the springs at? If this is what you want. <laughs> Bitch, you fucking think you can square up with me? Okay, okay, okay. He's squaring up with me, chat. He's squaring up with me. I did not want to do that twice, but shit, we'll take it. Yu-Gi-Oh! Your move. Hi, oh, Yugi boy. This is right underneath me. I'm not even holding it. a hidden one you couldn't find for an hour it as i kept going forward it kept looking like i was not close at all so <laughs> cloud by analyzing the life spring data i was able to locate an old republic transmitter chip it should be on a nearby island once they discovered mako in the area shinra established an offshore outpost oh but they've long since vacated the Isle, so I doubt you'll run afoul of their forces. Well, excavation. Oh, it starts off with an excavation, and then two more of these? Or within the final one, you pretty much finish it up. I think we've already been to that island. All right, it has a choco stop on it. It's this island right here, actually. Let's do the fiend until... game is scared Going the right way. 
Oh, there we go. Always follow the giant holes, chat. Oh, oh shit. Do not forget about that one. Hit Hogs Grotto. Okay, that wasn't it. I was severely misinformed. Yo, you what won't the hold fuck? back. Let's do this. I Pizza cake. We gotta get up here, so I think. I had the right idea the first time around. Just hover into it? No? Wow, it's squirting. And the only thing I can think of is here. But I really don't see I don't see anything to climb here. Next to where the first choco seed was? I don't even remember where that was. I feel like it would have to be in here. But it was this this was the grotto place. My motto, fuck grotto. I get the seven digits from your mother for a dollar tomorrow. All the green growth. Oh, wait, can I climb this? Excuse me? Thanks, chat. Exercise, exercise these nuts. I should have healed. We gotta switch it on here. One giant lot right now. Diva. Damn, I didn't break the 
jaw. Need a breather. I should have healed before I did this. I love the infinite uh, MP. I gotta unlock Soothing Breeze for Cloud. We gotta go back to the regions and uh, assess everything. We weren't doing that before. At all. Bussy coconuts. Jenova, have a good night. What's Bear doing so close? He just want to, you know, give us a little bit of a buddy energy. Shit, forgot about the ass attack. Damn it. I was trying to switch that time. Didn't work. Let's do Syndro Cyclone. Synchro Cyclone. That's so badass. <laughs> Yo, Yuffie was tossing his salad with those blizzards. <laughs> Cameraman fighting for his life in that corner. Yes. <laughs> I know, I haven't got any collectibles. Well, yeah, we got some default collectibles from the story, but I mean, I I have no idea what's in Johnny's uh, chest, besides love. God fucking damn. All right, cameraman tripping out right there. And our heroine triumphs again. You, you into heroin, bro? Let's do the excavation, because they always come in clutch from now. Be 
There's enemies here? Gonna finish it quick. I got you now. Poison cap. I need to beat hard mode to get that chest. True. Mm -mm -mm -mm. Wow, I should have I should have just did it in one shot. I thought about it and I was like, man, it'd be really cool if I did it, but eh. one more up here, maybe. Oh, up here, green vines. That's the tell right there. I didn't know that with this region, you have to like look for the green vine. All right, let's make a guess. Ready? Uh, nope. Nope. All right, fine. Watch. Watch this shit be right here. Oh, it's right there. Honestly, Rob, I, I absolutely, uh, I agree. <laughs> I mean... Just being real. Almost on your hard mode run. Hey, I'm trying to get on you. I'm trying to get on you. Well, not try to get on you, but you know, if you're okay with that, but I'm trying to get on your level. We should totally continue. With the Stara. Chat. Time to continue the Stara. Hey, what's up, my guy? You want some black materia? I heard Barry got two. I wish I told you how many you have. But of course, that's not the fun. Nibelheim's not far enough. First time I'm back since. Yep. <laughs> this First music. Didn't seem like coming back to me. Didn't think there was anything to come back to. Sorry. <laughs> it's all right. Lots happened since then. Ah, uh, Cloud, stay close, would you? <laughs> Of course. I honestly thought I was ready for this, but... <laughs> Sorry, I thought we were going to spend another 10 hours before we reach even... <laughs> in the bell. <sighs> if I had editors, sure. But I'm the editor, so no. Hoot! I don't give a hoot. Oh my god. Oh my. Oh my god. Oh my god. Help. Help me, Lord Jesus Christ. Oh my god. My bird is stuck. <laughs> Chat. <laughs> what do I do? Help. This is a problem. Carl Hamaguchi. Send in Square Enix now. I can fast travel, but don't worry. I can get out of this. Uh, 
It happens to the best of us. Elise, yo, let's go. Eight months, appreciate it. Game's great, keep forgetting you need to sleep. I I fully, fully get that, the feeling. Honestly, it's very, very mutual. Remember I said story time chat? Well, I lied. It's Mog story time. Thank you so much, Elise. Yellow material looking all so fine. This is my punishment for disrespecting the verb. <laughs> You're kind of right. Jump on the mushroom tips. No! Get in there, you fucking moogle. The fucking moogle mate. Invisibility, bitch! Uh. What you gonna do, brother? Oh, oh, that went. I did not think that was going that way. Fucking pussy. No, oh, I'm too close. Get in there. Oh my god, oh my god, oh my god, oh my god. Oh my god. <laughs> Fucking bitches. That's what you get. Yeah, 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 you little pussy ass bitch. That's what you get. Pushing me down! <laughs> Motherfuckers don't want to work. Looking like everybody in 2020 in this bitch. Two wasn't working, chat. I blame it on the frames. It's the 30 frames. Kaboom! Who said well, it wasn't that hard, Lipak? All thanks to you. There's only one more left to go. We've come so far, Koopo. I hope that There's you only one more. Room. What's the other region? <laughs> Did I forget one? Yeah, what you got? Tweaking, tweaking out that TCP, huh? Got Aerith and Red. Come again here. I will never come back here. Ever again. I'm actually filing a complaint with the BBB.
Maybe, yeah. I, I don't know. I could have sworn I got them all. Isn't this the last region? <laughs> Wait, what the fuck? Who is, who is this? Who is you? Really? Bro, you don't want to taste these. Okay, bucko. Get this intel. Totally. We're doing we're totally doing story stuff, chat. There's two in Corel? Oh yeah. Yeah, okay, so we did we did one next to um Costa, but I don't recall doing one in the desert. That makes sense. Corral's gotta be the biggest region because it's kinda like double. Right? It's double sized. Damn, bro, we shredded in this bitch, yas. Wait, oh, this is where I gotta go. Jaller Bridge. Oh, this is going straight into Nibelheim? Cool. I feel like there's something here, though. <laughs> Yo, that shit controlled weird. Damn, bro, we catching the air. We're in monster territory now. We're here. Monster territory. Allow me. I stand. They all did it. Same shit. Okay, cool. We got it. <laughs> it's close. I wasn't like sure. Oh my god, look how far that went. Dude, it keeps double tapping it. I swear I'm not doing that. I'm being robbed, chat. I'm being robbed. Nice. Yuffie has Aga spells now, finally. What happened to the buggy, by the way? It didn't break down. You just can't use it in the Gungaga region because Gungaga is like all foresty. Boom. Bada bum bum bum. Yay! We cheesed it. Fire tail that we to ice also. Oh, 
Hey! Blue fire will pressure it. Shroud wallet shrouded in blue fire. You fuck. Bong. Excellent work completing our combat objectives. Though I suspect it wasn't much of a challenge. Yeah, we flew to Tiny Bronco here. Stellar performance, Cloud. I can't thank you enough for providing such valuable combat intel. Our mm, but they're good. Thank God, I, I, I like my the combat simulator when you have and how she always like hates on uh, Charlie too. It's kind of funny. Or Chidadily. Needed by many, hated by all. I think he was coming from a different direction. Oh, no, 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 brother. Now, chapter 12, you go somewhere you've already been before. Where? Where? Quick, 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 Part of me wants to, like, search here, see what the fuck is going on. Might as well get it. Mm. 
I'm sure the chat doesn't mind me doing all this shit. This bridge is bogo as hell. Well, it's not a bridge, it's a pathway. Bing! Punch through. Zoo enemies. It's funny because I, I keep thinking, I'm like, yo, we came across a bunch of these before. And I'm like, wait a minute. Technically, no, because that intro portion is not the same. I did it again. I did have it up. Just a little bit. Yeah, in the intro, chapter one portion, when you do the flashback, you fight against a bunch of zoos. Oh, I appreciate it, Philo. Doing the exact same thing right now, cool. Is the path even further? We... Oh, there totally is. What the hell, Bobby? I keep forgetting these guys swing first. You know, technically, you can get double procs, right? Yeah, Yuffie and the uh, the clone pop it twice, so it's kind of like a replacement for air. It's Ward, in a way. Thing is, not everybody can use it. Oh shit! I didn't pressure them. I just went to Hamlin and clapping their cheeks. Hey, Mater. Let's have a go at it again. Tally ho. I really wish you could get three first strike materials. Alright, what is it? Elemental weakness will pressure it. Are you kidding me, bro? But we mean we totally were doing that. The clap always overpowers the objectives.
the clapping. What is that? Wait, what is that? Alright, this is probably a side mission thing. One that I can't access yet? No, 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 Yugi boy. So... I mean, I could go here. No, that looks like it's blocked off too. From here, up here maybe? What the fuck? A pool? A nasty ass water pool. Five Moogle medals. Bro, is that Billy? Alright, well, I found the side quest. Can I make Cloud wow. swim in that? Billy? What are you doing out here? Um, I haven't had much luck at the racetrack lately. Not the <laughs> good kind. That's Man, you for suck. Sure. Oh, that's right. We still so got to do chocobo races. Train? Here? You don't know where you are? This is the home of the Chocobo Sage, a living legend. They Surely moved the Chocobo the Sage? Man. Isn't he supposed to be on the North Continent? <laughs> Did someone say living legend? <coughs> Barely alive legend. Are you okay, sir? <sighs> I am now. Thought I was a goner. Smell like huh? broke over here. Mind telling me who you are? They don't get many visitors out here in the boonies. Uh, this is Cloud. He's a jockey for Gramps' ranch. Oh, he is, huh? Perfect. Billy here needs some help. You can pick up the poor boy's slack. There's this big race at the saucer, the Gold Cup, and it's coming up soon. We gotta get in on that. So I came here to bone up. I'm learning all sorts of stuff. See? Hey, tell me you're not buying this choco dung. Picking garbage out of a pool isn't training. It's manual labor. Yeah. <laughs> you see it too, right? The man's not a sage. The sage is a real deal. <laughs> What's the funniest option here? Well, though he's not a sage, this guy's like the king of the crazy old coots. Don't know about coot, but Gramps did say he was already old when he was young. If you can flap your gums, you can move your gams. Now get on back to your training. Sorry. As for you, I know just the thing. One of my chocobos ran off when we put her out to pasture. Need you to find her. Bring her back. You're asking me? Her name is Selena. Ain't your normal choke. Bro, you either. are ass. We already got that. Home. The way she makes rolling waves look like solid ground. No wonder she thinks she's the bee's knees. Please, Cloud, would you mind? Just think of it as Sorry, a clearing up space. Me? You've got a gift for wrangling the wild ones. The bird that runs on water? I already found him. Yeah. There you are, Selena. What are you well, crazy? The bird was standing there the whole time. Oh, oh, there you are. To tame this girl. Skills like those of. Hold on. I know this. I do. Why can't I remember? Oh, damn it! This is gonna bother me all day. Oh. Aha! There we go. It was Sam and Will. What? They were far and away my best disciples. As I was saying, you, Cloud, you may well become as talented a trainer as them one day. Bro, I ain't giving my chocobo to this guy. Right? Sam, you gotta tell me everything you know about. Oh shit, he knows chocobo Sam. You're gonna give me whiplash, son. <sighs> the Sam guy you taught. 
You mean Chocobo Sam out of Midgar? I do, but why do you want to know? Because me and him, we got history. You see, I'm Will's son. Well, don't that beat all. Well, he knows I'll the family. Never forget those two. They had such a powerful passion and an eagerness to learn too. Everything oh shit, he did train them. For the birds. Oh, That's he's lying. Not Sam, I know. Sam's a demon. He led my parents to an early grave. Got them hooked on gambling. Pushed them to rack up tons of debt. And then. Eh, that don't sound like him to me. <laughs> you sure you ain't got your Sam's mixed up? It's a common name, you know. Only one Sam in this business. I swore that I'd humiliate him by winning the gold cup. Destroy his reputation. Then I'd at least have some kind of revenge for what that bastard did to my parents. Hmm. Now that that's out of your system... You're missing two choco grass and it's driving Excuse you me? insane? Did you check the you bridge? Me. On you your way to Mount Nebel? Chocobos, Sorry, to Nibelheim? To There's like a bridge pathway uh, with water? Underneath it, I found God. two. For your next task, I'll need you to take Selena and gather choco grass, which so happens to grow above bodies of water. You kidding me? This fossil's trying to get us to do his dirty work again? <laughs> he gonna get high off that choco grass. Yo, this dude's extra. Choco grass is a genuine panacea. I kid you not. It'll cure whatever ails you, and then some. And once I am cured, maybe I'll be inclined to share more stories about the good old days. <sighs> He's obviously full of it. If not for him, then please do it for me. I need to know what happened to my dad. <sighs> okay. When I said it grows above water, I This is a above. very long dialogue. I it's lost interest like flower. Because it grows in the air. When he said Sam. But with an ocean chocobo, you can harvest the stuff with ease. 30 tufts ought to do. Best hop to it, Cloud. You don't want my death on your hands, do you? <laughs> okay, chat. I really wish I listened to you guys and collected everything. Oh, look. Let's see what uh they got in the region. Have you come to brush up on your bird handling? As soon as I heard the legendary took, I was surprised to see a recluse residing in such luxury. Even hermits enjoy a dip in the pool. Ka oh, it's a wrap. It's over. ATB assist. Dark side. Allows you to use dark side when active, increases the potency of abilities, but causes you to suffer damage when they're used. What if he... What if you attach HP Absorb to this? Come, Meteor. That sounds interesting. Bro, ATB we'll assist. It's a rap chat. That's Tifa all day. Tifa's a purple mage. We'll keep her like that. Yeah, focus strike. Well, yeah, the thing is. For ATB assist to function, from what I noticed in Remake, you can't cancel an animation. You actually have to do two of them back to back. So like True Strike are two quick animations. So once Tifa gets True Strike, you can use it twice and get it back. Other than that, you have to do two moves without a break in between it, back to back. So like, yeah, you can't like dodge or cancel it like that. Fascinating possibilities. Oh, you get your hands on that choco grass. I have 45 choco grass. Well, well, if it ain't my 
my beloved choco grass. This stuff can be one hell of a hassle to gather. Yo, he getting I high. I had you to get it this is me. Ramu's cousin. Okay, so what are you gonna do with it? <laughs> I suppose you've earned the right to know. First, I take this fluff, mix it with some chocobo feathers, and let it ferment. Once it's dry, I boil it all down. Then I squeeze it all out and voila, my patented choco tincture. That's some kind of magic medicine? Oh no, just a little fun. This wrinkly cheeky old... <laughs> Speaking of grass, if you've got some extra tufts on hand, would you mind sharing them with my assistant at the shop? I promise I'll make it worth your while. Sigaweed! Tell me about my father. Hold your chocobo, son. There's Chuckle still weed. one thing you need to do for me first. What a surprise. This geezer isn't gonna tell you Jack. Susie Young is amazing as Yuffie. You got a lot she's a phenomenal nerve. actress overall, but she nails it. After all the nails it I've for shared. every role she's in. All the what now? So you haven't realized you've been training this whole time? Tracking down Selena forced you to get in touch with a chocobo's I feel like I've done a lot of quests that, that involve Yuffie. You did? And I know that they're, they're trying to like catch us up with her because she joins the party late. Key skills for any aspiring jockey. What do you say, Cloud? Bet you feel like a real choco pro by now. Can't say I do. Sounds to me like you need more training. Reckon we ought to add one more item to your regimen. Think of it as a final trial of sorts. Oh, give me a break. Don't go changing the subject here, Gramps. We're not doing your stupid trial. No, it's fine. I'll do it. Then it's settled. I'll be your opponent. And what? And dear Selena will be your steed. If Cloud wins, does that mean you'll finally tell me about my dad? You've got a deal. But know that I won't be pulling any punches out there. When you're ready, give me a holler and we can hit the track. Yo, is a blue material? Bro. Okay, cool. Level boost. Nice. We got like three level boost materials. I was worried it was going to be warding. Oh, he does have an assistant. You got any choco grass for me? Thanks. If you find any more, I'll be here. Now how about plumes? Cleansing materia earrings. A galahorn. Oh, it's a red it's a um K Sith weapon. Interesting. I know the sage is a bit of a handful, but stick with it, okay? It'll all pay off in the end. I promise. So I need three more. You prepared to undertake the final trial? Choco armband. I'm going for the acceleration because I have no idea what this track's going to look like. Uh, it actually doesn't matter, uh, at least. You can equip it on the weapon or the armband. Oh my god, it's an actual course. I thought it was going to be some bullshit Nibelheim thing. Oh, X to go. I missed it.
Yeah, go your own way, you fucking loser. Fuck. Oh, I lost speed. Alright, so he took a shortcut somehow. I could probably get two on that one. All right, max out at ten. Hey, yo, get the get off me, bro. Fuck. I can shoot it. Oh my god. I thought it was like a shield. Sage's ass. Chocobo armband. Plucked by ever loving feathers. That was one hell of a performance. Surprise. Well, shoot. You got me. And once you start tearing up the track out there, the racing world will blame me for letting you loose. A promise is a promise, sir. Hmm. All right, then. Let's see. They couldn't have been much older than you are now. The two of them came and asked me to take them under my wing. Turned them down, seeing as I'd already retired. But they hung around the grounds anyway. Since they had nothing better to do, I put them to work. And that's how it all began. What were they doing well, here? wasn't nothing out of the ordinary. I would ran some errands, did some repairs, helped around the house. You know, and in their downtime, they took it upon themselves to dig through my library. Learning about chocobos and how to handle them. Came to differing conclusions. They used to argue something fierce. I can't say the two of them got on terribly well. I figured. Will and Sam had mighty strong opinions about how to best raise chocobos. And it drove them to fight. With their words and with their fists. Damn. That said, it was beefing only hard. reason those two fought as hard as they did. It's because they both cared deeply about the cause. As far as passion His is concerned, wrist is tripping out. the two of them were birds of a feather. Hmm. How you... F uh, uh, what do you mean? When we first met, I saw the way your eyes were brimming with anger. I knew right then and there that what you needed wasn't teaching or training. What you needed was time. Time to look deep inside yourself. Which is why you had him clean out the pool. Oh, the pool's clean exactly. now. Shit. I don't know what happened to your father after he left this place. And I can understand why you'd want to beat old Sam in a race. Few things feel better than sticking it to someone who did you wrong. But that being said, damn it, I wanted to swim in never the dirty pool, use Chad. your birds as tools for revenge. Ask yourself, why did I decide to start raising chocobos? I guess... I guess it's because I saw how happy those birds made my mom and dad. How they'd smile. The chocobos brought us a lot of fun. And brought us together as a family. Good enough. The why is important. So don't forget yours. I reckon Sam's got his eyes on the gold cup. Keep yours unclouded by hatred Ooh. and you'll do fine. So if we do all the chocobo Thank races, you. we get to sure. get an encounter with Sam. Thanks for everything. I'm gonna head back to the saucer. Make sure our birds are ready for the big race. Don't worry about putting your name in. I'll take care of it. All you need to do is show up and win. Yuffay!
So we have three more. Sorry, we have three more choco grass. Yo, Kirkos! Welcome to the squad tier, dude. Enjoy the emojis, man. Appreciate it. Talk to the sage again for some funny dialogue. Hey there. What do you say? Want to smoke some of this tincture? <laughs> so, how's it feel riding Selena? Elegance incarnate, ain't she? Smoke them. Hey there. What do you say? Want to smoke some of this tincture? He's smoking on that za, guys. That choco za. All right. Now for a story, chat. For a story. Can I tell you guys a story? Wait, are we going away? How the fuck did that happen? I thought I was going up here the whole time. Oh, I should save. Yeah, we ain't saving over an hour and 50. Bridge is back up too. Damn, this is cool. Oh shit. Wait, what? My thought. Can I get elixirs from all the people? Don't scare me like that. Thought Cloud might have lost it again. I mean, I thought he got us lost. Because it looks different. So, who do you think rebuilt it? Shinra. Never mind all that. We've got a terminal to find. It makes Kate Sith so much more cuter. Oh shit, hey, chat. Uh, let me guess. Cure to visit someone? This is where they keep the patients who have milder cases. Patients? You're an odd one to come out to the middle of nowhere like this. Bitch, I grew up here. You wasn't with me shooting in the gym. Patience? The fuck? This is like a, a health facility for these guys? You know what? That's actually a decent re like a, a change for this area because there was this town was filled with reunion people. But it really didn't make much sense as to why. 
planning on building a new facility for the patients. The village, one step at a time. Huh. This is very, very interesting now. So those creepy outfits you see. These kids are still here? How the fuck have y'all not grown up yet? Red light, green light. It's okay. Take all the time you need, all right? Just relax. You're all right. Hey, lucky cat. Doing good. Doing great. How are you doing? I'm just like so excited, man. Every time we get to new areas in this game. Well, shit. A lot of robes out here. Yeah. And look, locals. Hmm. Cloud's house. Only they aren't quite the same, are they? Hello there. Can I help you? Greetings, good sir. I am a proud employee of Shinra Resorts. And since I was nearby, I thought I might pop in and check something on the company database. And your companions? Oh, them? They are... I used to live here until... You know. I see. And are you aware of what Nibelheim is now? Nope. No oh, loony bin. Uh, five years ago, Shinra assumed direct control over this village. It now serves as a treatment center for Mako poisoning. All property rights have been transferred. If that's why you're here, contact special facilities at corporate. They'll be able to help you. This guy's voice Very is weird. Helpful. Thank you, sir. Ah, but the database. I'll not be a wee minute. Uh, uh, he didn't say you can. I'm sure you're eager to see your hometown, but please don't stay too long. I feel like the database isn't there. I feel like it would be in the Shinra Manor. Yeah, we haven't disturbed his slumber yet. <laughs> There's nothing here, you know. Bitch, I just got here. No dialogue options. Hey, yo, what the fuck? Barrett, you can absolutely wait. So, any friends here you want to see? Maybe a girlfriend? <laughs> Speaking of which, I'll bet you're dying to hear about mine. Am I right? What? Not interested? <laughs> I'm gonna tell you anyway. She's real pretty. No. Beautiful. Kinda depends on the angle. <laughs> She's just great to be around. She from Midgard? Yep. Real city mouse. He remembers from Gungaga. Head over heels for Eric. We fought together as soldiers. I'm at a loss for words right now. You were here with me five years ago. Shit. You came with me on the mission. It's from the trailer. <laughs> Go 
Go on, Cloud. Where are you? What happened to you? His voice got really soft there. One step at a time, chat. Oh my god. Ooh, a missed megapot. Well, that's exciting. Shit, I didn't think he would actually ever say uh, Zach's full name and not, like, freak out. They're everywhere you look. You don't really think that all these guys decided to get up and shuffle over here of their own accord, do you? Of course not. This is Shinra's doing. First, they raise a whole village because it suits them. Then they build a fake one right on top of it. We can't let those corporate bastards keep getting away with this shit. We gotta do something, right? Three. Hell yeah, you're right. Screw them. That's the spirit. Screw them. We'll make them pay for what they did to y'all's home. These boys are lucky they got us looking out for them. If Shinra tries anything, I'll make sure they don't succeed. I don't know how Barrett feels comfortable in here. Especially with the music stop. He's high off the choco grass. Hey, Reef! Question. This always been here? Yeah. Yeah, this is where me and Tifa, it you know. It totally screams, climb me, doesn't it? So, let's give the poor thing what it wants and see the sights. Hey, don't just... Cloud's like, that's sacred. Oh god, is that Tifa in Tifa's house? She's in the lookout. See us here? To look at this place, you'd never know. Yeah. Which one's your house? That one. Oh, looks cozy. <laughs> After I set it on fire, yes. I'm sorry. I shouldn't have said that. No, don't worry about it. It's all new to you. That building right there is the inn, where I stayed five years ago. You got the town hall, the general store, and that there, Tifa's house. Yeah. <laughs> She ain't bothered. So let me guess. This is where you kept lookout. Huh? Come on, you never came up here hoping she'd wave? Oh my god, and she just did. Probably. Sounds like something I'd do. If I was in your shoes, I would have been up here all the time. Aerith is team Cloud and Tifa. I don't know how people don't see it. I'm gonna head down. I think I'm good where I am. I'll see you later. <laughs> you know where we going. Oh shit, we got you Queen's blood. Don't look ill. Passing through, I take it. If you are feeling unwell though, you'll have to wait. I'm ill. I'm ill. I'm ill. I'm ill. What are you guys eating? Damn, they eating good. Shit. Is that avocados? Used as a as a as a wrap? Damn. This is where we care for the patients. We provide checkup. 
strip. You might have noticed how some of our patients have number tattoos on their arms. Yeah, I know about that. Hold on, Tifa. You know, hmm? I never understood it. Why'd my dad go into the reactor? Why chase Sephiroth? Thought about it ever since waking up in Corral. It just seemed like such a bad idea. I mean, what did he think he was gonna do? Fight a famous war hero and win? Well, he didn't. But after moving to Midgar, after making a life for myself, I finally realized where my dad was coming from. He was angry. And he'd had enough. Everything he'd worked so hard for had been destroyed Man. in an instant. Character relationships he built for himself and putting for a big us, focus gone. on it in this game was such Seth a smart Roth move. Burned it to the ground. That's the why characters are so great and just all their interactions together are so and like captivating. Him, I took my pain, my grief, everything I was feeling. I took it all and turned it into anger. Anger that led me to avalanche. <laughs> The problem is, anger doesn't last. So when Avalanche started to become more violent, there wasn't enough left to hold back the fear and the doubt. It was taking a toll. Then you turned up. Have I helped you get through it at all? Yeah, you have. If it wasn't for you, I wouldn't have had the courage to come back here. Damn, the other option. I should have went with the other option. Now that we're here, I know this was the right decision. Because now I know they rebuilt everything. Tried to sweep what they did under the rug. And I should have said the fate thing. Happened. But I won't let them. I can't. Sephiroth and his cruelty. Shinra and their lies. I'm sick of all of it. Damn, Brit Baron's so good. Um... Can't save scum. That's the best one for Tifa, what you said? Okay. I'm so good, chat. Talk to her again? Oh, everybody's saying talk to her again. Okay. So in the demo, they only had the Ruby Red poster. It was in the inn in the town. And where that poster is now, right there, was a Zell poster, which I'm pretty sure is probably still in the town. It's in a lot of other towns now. This Emerald by the Sea one was added in the full game, though, I think. And that's pretty fucking hilarious. It's like trigger inducing. <laughs> Remember when we were kids, how you'd, you know, always be looking at me? I, uh, what? <laughs> Every time we made eye contact, you'd look away. And when I tried to talk to you, you'd ignore me. Not surprised. I was a pain in the ass as a kid. <laughs> I was the opposite. I needed everyone to like me all the time. Part of me still does, I think. I kind of hate that about myself. Tifa is such character growth. Gotta get it together. Gotta get it together. That was funny. Um, Tifa, you think you still- No, it wouldn't still be there. I'm not sure why that is. Cloud, she knew what she was doing. No, Dale. Leave the man alone. Dale! I can play Queen's Blood with you. If that's what you want, okay? I'm so sorry. This is Dale. He loves playing Queen's Leave Blood. Leave Dale the fuck alone, man. Let him play some Queen's Blood. Actually, I don't suppose you would mind playing a match or two with him. Just real quick. Guys, make I'm sure you hit that like player. button so and I subscribe you if you're new. We've got lots of Final Fantasy VII content coming up. Oh yeah, we still gotta play against Wy uh, Wise. I almost said Vice. Wise. Dale, what the fuck you doing? You're looking stupid. Dumb. Nincompoop. Shh. 
shitty shitabati bati clot hand. I should, I should go up top, keep it balanced. Holy shit, that Shinra officer has five points. That is crazy, man. That is crazy. Don't go middle, 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 don't go middle. Every time, every fucking, every fucking time, you little fuck fuck ass bitch. Little booty tang ass hoe. God damn it, man. They always playing so fucking defensive. I started off with a really bad hand, honestly. Uh, 15. Uh, he's gonna he's gonna definitely get more than 15. I need to start off with a fucking better hand, foo. Drop you, drop you, and for now, drop you. All right, that's what I'm talking about. That's a more fucking hand right there. Yeah, more fucking hand right there. Go up, go up. Yeah, boy. I'll just do this. Get the Midgar Stormer out one time. Yu Gi Oh! I should do this. He's gonna take that middle one, but it's fine. Hey, my eye. Like something just like flew into it. Ouch. I'm gonna go bottom. I'm just waiting for him to play again because then Titan can take over that piece. Because if I played Titan first, then he would have just taken it. And I basically win. Fucking replace cards, bro. God, man. I need to start putting these in my deck. Like, as annoying as they are, like, this is so clutch. He might have won. Maybe not. Let's see. We got 10 plus 10. Another replace. All right, bitch. Fuck. When you win the lane, receive a bonus of 10. Oh my God. That's a crazy card. All right, he watched me. I didn't think he had replacement decks, uh, replacement shits. I'm gonna drop, I'm gonna drop this. Cause I have a replacement thing. Drop that guy.
destroy an allied card and replace it. Griffin does buff the other ones, though. But... Mm, This one might be the best, because it goes in all kinds of different directions to replace. So I add Insectoid for now, and we'll, uh, let's remove one thing. Take out J-Sweeper. Space Rider. Actually, this is a pretty good hand. I can get Jockey going up top. Or I'd prefer bottom. don't feel too good now does it all right I could win by doing this Up a Ron. No, he has another one. God damn it, dude! I gotta fill my deck up with that shit. This shit is like super important. Right, I think I win. Yeah, you definitely need those those uh replacement cards in your deck. This way you could play freely. Cause like you could double up in the middle and if they take it back, it's fine. You just destroy one of your sacrifice one of your other ones and take the point. Oh wow. I don't think I've ever seen him this happy. It must have been a great match. That's enough, Dale. Oh shit. He has other it's a shadow blood do, queen. Thank you so much for taking the time to play with him. Genova's the Shadow Blood Queen. Someone would brief us on these things, considering we are the ones who actually have to look if you're here to visit someone, I love the door, door open. Let's not. Where is Yuffie? Am I only working out here? Oh, right. Here. Looks like the reactor's not too far. 
Hey, Cloud. Ever been up there before? Yeah. <laughs> then give me the skin. She doesn't know the story. Like? Was there buttloads of Talk to Aerith again? All right. What about, say, oh, materia? Yep. Some of them even form naturally. All right. No way. Naturally? Oh, man. You got my mouth watering. Okay. Put your fingertips together. I regret that decision. Something about that place doesn't sit right with me. You mean Shinra Manor? Oh, sorry. No one wants to hear people badmouth their hometown. Hey, I'm with you. Never liked that place. Just looking at it gives me the creeps. Hopefully the company's not using it anymore. Yeah, you could be mean as hell to him. Talk shit about his town. Hey, I just came back from your hometown and that shit smelled like salt water. Stupid. If you don't mind, I'd like to be alone. Are you angry? Mm-hmm. At me? Not at you. At everything. Must be nice. To have a friend you've known since you were a kid. Someone you can say, remember the time when, to Someone you can reminisce with. I don't have anyone like that. And it feels like I'm being taunted for it. Which stings. More than it should. That is why I want to be alone. Plus, I might take it out on you, and I don't want that. I don't mind. Well, I do, and it'd only make me feel worse. Thank you, though. I kind of really? get her, but... I'll be down in a bit. We got friends. See you then. Remember that time we were at Calm and your back was stiff and then Tifa massaged it and it wasn't stiff anymore? <laughs> Good times. See? We could do shit like that. We got a box for him to stand on. The fuck? You. You don't happen to be a card player, do you? It's no use denying it. You're slacking off because you want to play. Do you Queen's know me, sir? Because you're just like me. <laughs> I won't tell if you won't, comrade. The name's Turner, the top truant. I say, screw working. I'm all about playing hooky. You'd be hard pressed to find anyone who's better at it than me. I don't give a damn about demotions. Prepare yourself. Are well, you about to be the rank, sir? Bum, bum, bum. Well, now that I have the replacements, uh, and I started off with two. Shit. Ah, uh, should be good to just hop in and go in. I think. Let me test this out. Yeah, he's gonna take it. And I'm gonna take it back. Thank you, CPU, for inspiring me. And... Mm, if I take that, he's just gonna go up top and middle and take it back. Might as well. I know punk bitch. Holy shit. Bro, those replacement cards are no joke. <laughs> okay, yeah. yeah. Should have saw that coming.
course. You got a bunch of those too. Alright, he can't have any more. There's no way, right? Yeah, okay. Dominate. Boy. We already did, uh, we already did, um, Aerith's, uh, dialogue option. Nice. 48. You replace, I replace harder. Bitch. Raise power by two for each other enfeebled allied card. Really? That was impressive. I didn't think you beat me so easily. When I entered contests on the clock, I always won. Wait, could you be more of a slacker than me? But I devote all my time outside of roll calls specifically to playing Queen's. <laughs> oh, me too. You're unemployed, living the dream. <sighs> no, that's none of my business. You want to be unemployed? You're a bigger Say less. Fish. My sword has unemployed a lot it of your people. To have played with you. I hope I'll have another chance someday. <laughs> Cool. I think I could make this deck even a little bit better if I put the other two. Sorry, I have another replacement. Not the Griffin. The Griffin's eh. It's whatever. Either the Grand Horn, which is three, or the Gigantoad. This buffs, but I'll never have a teammate, a, a card of mine that can buff top in front. That's just not my play style. I wouldn't be, I wouldn't play behind like that. This is good if you're playing behind. Grand Horn seems to be good though. Maybe I could put one. Right, I could put one. And I'll drop, maybe I'll drop the Posh Chocobo. I don't really get a benefit out of it. Or I could drop the Levicron. Let's count. Let's see how many. Okay, I have one down. Two. Three. Four. Five. Six. Seven. Eight. And how many tops do I have? One. Two. Three. Four. Five. Six. Seven. Eight. It's equal. Well. I could drop the Levicron. Grandhorn and Gigantoad are lifesavers. Yeah, I could. Actually, you know what? They're the exact same shapes. Sorry, the exact same fields as the Grasslands Wolf and the Levicron. There you go. Good point. So I could just, I could drop them. And I should be good to swap it out. I talk to everybody. I should have known it was too good to be true. I only have limited access from this console. Let me guess. Limited doesn't cut it. Nope. But all is not lost. Excuse me, good sir. Would you be so kind as to grant us entry into Shinra Manor? Don't you have clearance for that? <laughs> oh, if only. I'm but a wee bottom feeder. Barely have clearance to use the bathroom, me. 
Be that as it may, I can't let you in there myself. You'll have to ask my boss instead. Meaning the deputy commissioner? Or the commission himself? Let's meet and greet. Deputy Commissioner Murasaki's up at the reactor, conducting an inspection for corporate. He's due back the day after tomorrow, but he hasn't been in touch to confirm. Could be he needs more time. Uh, we can't afford to dilly-dally. Then we'll just have to track him down. Agreed. Thanks for all the help, pal. Nice. All right, so we got to find Murasaki. The Mutter Saki. Let's take a little break. And... So, you're headed to the reactor, huh? Headed to the reactor? No luck at Town Hall, I take it? Hmm. Gotta get a key card. A guy named Murasaki has it, but he's inspecting the reactor. Well then, you'll need a ninja to accompany you. I'm coming with. Me too. Really? <gasps> you sure? It's my team. Ask anyone around here. I'm the best there is. Oh, <laughs> got her. You sure you're gonna be okay? We're going on a hike and getting a key card. How tough gonna be? You'll still be gone for a while. I'm sure there's nothing you need to take care of? I'm putting you in charge of provisions. Let's make it snappy. My materia needs me. Um. Yeah, we're good. Damn, class level 41. New bridge just went in, you know. Might shave some time off the trip. Sounds like a new a bridge. All right. The same bridge? Tifa's like, haven't you heard? There's nobody better than me for these mountains. <laughs> Famous last words. Sir, we've received word about the Nibelheim survey team. It appears they were ambushed. Nibelheim survey team? By Wu Tai. <laughs> Indeed, and so it begins. What the fuck is Wu Tai doing in Nibelheim? Well, exactly what Rufus wants, Hurry apparently. Up already! That the new bridge I see up ahead? Yeah, this is where the game started, chat. Good stuff. But I think this is a good stopping point. Because it is uh, 5.32 a.m. by me. Which means my Saturday <laughs> tomorrow is uh, going to start... much later it's because we did the uh we did a uh dragon ball stream a little earlier we're playing um legendary sand dead setsu <laughs> f's in the chat Oh shit. Hey guys, no need to argue in Twitch chat, yo. You're, it's all good. <laughs> We're not slandering any characters. Stuck in Coral Desert uh, on your own free will because you're having so much fun exploring or because you, you actually can't figure out what to do next? Joshua. Got two more quests to do. Royal Pair, welcome back, bro. Bro, you've been a sub for like three years. What happened? You unsub for me, Royal Pair? How dare you? <laughs> You're a member. <laughs> and you resubbed. 
yeah it, it happens man i've seen youtube just remove people that have been that have been following us for a long time man it sucks no i know you're a member like it's it's clear like like you know <laughs> tony stark <laughs> they don't want me to sleep it could stream longer oh man i wish i could i wish i started a little earlier i did say i wanted to start earlier around seven or six but i got i was so busy before i could not and i just wasn't able to find the time to jeez bro this cosmo canyon and nibelheim episode though what the fuck am i gonna do about this that's a lot i'm also i also only have 250 gigs of recording space left and we started with 1.5 terabytes mind you uh i could probably yeah you know what i could remove uh chapter one and what else i could remove chapter one going up until uh chapter seven since we've uploaded those vods and i've already rendered those so i could delete those Chapter my own? This is chapter 11. It's pretty much the beginning of chapter 11. Like, we just started the story, the story mission. About to go out to the reactor with Tifa and Yuffie. I almost said Aerith. His space is like five gigs left. Are you currently working on a how to video? Uh, actually, I'm debating right now. Either a Yuffie how to video, a Kate Sith how to video, or a Queen's Blood how-to video what do you think of Sid from that small part of him I want him inside of me I mean I want him inside of my party can't forget how can't figure out how to do the last two quests hmm do Queen's Blood all right we'll do Queen's Blood and uh we'll talk about like the general strategies and uh, also with the the replacement decks, the replacement cards, and swapping those out. You got a glitch proto relic quest. You can't finish all for all the end game stuff. What Hayabusa for real? That's crazy. What region is it? Damn, yo, your your reaction time to my ch that was instant. I asked that question and you immediately replied. <laughs> That's kind of wild, like how uh, low the latency is between us. Because it depends on the region. Depending on where people are, it, it, it can, it can't. Ninja typing. <laughs> Evil, huh? I haven't even started, like... Uh, I did some of the, the exploration stuff, but I haven't done any of the proto-relic stuff yet, so... Alright, so Queen's Blood first, then Yuffie, then Kate Sith. Okay. Tomorrow I'll woke I'll start woke I'll, tomorrow I'll wake up and start working. Combine the two words. Everybody's favorite, right? <laughs> I'll combine <laughs> I'll work on Yuffie's after the Queen's blood. Kate Sith is gonna be fun. Me too. Like it felt weird, Adam. Like, cause like my whole thing is to dodge to get in with the team and kate sith like you jump off of the moogle if you dodge in and his range without the moogle is kind of shit he's definitely a first strike character you need first strike on him for sure and atb boost but i am curious the exploding the moogle does give him back atb though the dodge and dive he detonates the moogle on people How do you stay up so late? It has to be that Sri Lanka power. Hey, that's racist, bro. I'm West Indian. I am not East Indian. I am from the Caribbean, sir. Always use uh, Cloud Tifa and either Red or Aerith. Oh my God, the AC just turned on. It feels great. Why wasn't that on the whole time? What the fuck? It's hot as hell in this room. 
I can't wait for my new office. I am installing a uh, personal AC unit. It's okay, Jenna. I don't, but to be honest, how do I stay up so late? I've always been able to since I was a kid. I have FOMO and the, when my mind is working on stuff and I'm thinking about things, I just, I have to, to do it. And like when I play like this game, I feel like it's like time is, time is obviously passing by quick, but it doesn't feel like it. Like it does not feel like we've been streaming for, where is it? five hours on this one and then we did like three hours on the other one so we've we've been streaming since shit chat eight o'clock eight something eight thirty that's almost 12 it's almost an 11 hour stream no my math isn't mathing shut up 10 hour stream ps5 heating up the room it's not just the ps5 it's the lights like uh let me show you guys real quick if i turn the lights off I'm gonna show y'all what this shit looks like. Let me disable the ACM. Yeah, that's the lights. It already feels cooler in here. It already does. Uh, yes, Miss Braddock, we're, we're actually leaving off right now. Beginning of chapter 11. We'll be back. I don't know if we'll be back streaming tomorrow. Saturdays, I don't really, I don't usually stream, which I should reconsider because I know a lot of streamers stream on Saturday because majority of viewers are home and available in all kinds of regions. But maybe, maybe I'll test things out tomorrow. But tomorrow I will be live on uh, Final Fan TV's channel, which by the way... You guys should totally check them out. Let me see. We're going to be live talking about FF7 on Final Fan TV's uh, Twitch channel and YouTube channel. It's pretty dark. Yeah, bro. Yeah, we're going to be talking. It's a spoiler free discussion. No spoilers at all. It's going to be a good one. Final Fan TV is pretty fun. They always have like game shows and cool talks and all that stuff. We also have, I'm, I'm gonna be doing a Family Feud game show at the end of the month on their channel as well. Thank you, anime. I got the notify for the Final Fan Podcast, nice. Yeah, we're gonna be live tomorrow. Me, Professor Noctis, Subtex, and Daniel. And I'm pretty sure Firaga Fighter is gonna be there. He's always there, I imagine. So, it'll be a good one. Yeah, imagine like, and this is like my room with just the light over there. And without these lights, crazy part. And this is it with just one light. Let's put on the other one again. Oh my God. I need to buy new lights. <laughs> I need to buy new lights that have a softer filter on it because geez hell yeah the game is super addicting dude one of my thoughts on the sales rumors for final fantasy 7 rebirth i think i'd rather wait for the official digital and physical numbers of every single region combined before we say it's a failure because it didn't sell much in Japan, a place that's not really selling a lot of console games already. Should always open the windows, man. Hey, bro, I live in Florida. And uh, last month, it would have been good to open up windows because it's nice and cool. But yeah, don't open windows up in the nighttime in Florida. You're about to get a bunch of bugs in here. Even if you have a screen, I have a mesh screen on all my windows. Uh, bugs still make their way in. What if I streamed like this? Just, ah, uh, yeah. 
Yeah. <laughs> Y'all wouldn't be able to see shit. You, you couldn't even tell if I'm like looking at the chat or <laughs> what the fuck I'm doing. Is Max live? Yo, I swear he has been live. Oh, wow. He took today off. That's surprising. Grimms is live. But the problem with Grimms is you can't really raid him because he has his follow thing set to a month. You have to be following him for a month to be able to chat in his chat. Which I get it. He's trying to avoid spoilers like crazy. I am the only one at 5.45 a.m. still streaming. Yeah, plus a lot of the physical sales. I imagine digitals are gonna gonna count big time because there's a lot a significant amount of people that double purchased the game that couldn't wait for their physical collectors that got lost or delayed to come in, so they ended up buying the digital ones. Max has only taken three breaks from FF7 Rebirth, and it's still to stream other games. He took a break, and he went and he streamed, I think it was Helldivers. And he did another game, and then he did the Xbox Showcase. Oh, no, but the, after the Xbox Showcase, he, he was streaming uh, FF7. It's also sub chat only too. Where on um Grimm's stream? The no light looks cool, it's too warm and you're warm as it is. Oh you know what? Let's actually try with all the lights off. This is with all my lights off. You just see the chocobo in the back. Yes. Just embracing the coolness. Mad Dog, thanks so much for the sub. Royal Pear, Kirkos, Frederick, Samuel as well. Thank you guys. Yeah, now it's just the this, this screen. I know fits. I can't wait to get to endgame, man. I feel like that I feel like within the next three streams we could be at endgame, but um some of my friends already kind of spoiled it for me, but I know chapter 12, you get a whole lot of new side quests and shit to do. So I feel like chapter 12 will have its own dedicated day where we tackle as much things as we can and try to 100% areas and go back and forth, backtrack, do all the extra things. And um, then we uh, have 13 for its own dedicated thing. This game's gonna be crazy when it comes back on P when it comes out on PC, man. Oh my god. <laughs> Unlocking all that shit. We're all slow, don't worry. How many chapters left? I think that's a spoiler if I say, so I'm not going to say it. It's alright, Stu. In this industry, working this type of business, being a content creator and a streamer, you're not guaranteed to play a new game without getting spoiled for something. Even things your chat wants to see you play, they, the chat will spoil it. It's happened to me many times. Looking at Legend of Dragoon. Hey, what's up, Chepo? Uh, I wonder what the DLC would be like in Rebirth. Maybe Vincent. They said no DLC. They kind of hard confirmed it and said no DLC. Basically, they want to focus and put all hands on deck for part three. So it doesn't take too long to make.
Can't get the baby chocobo material from DoorDash. Do I have that one? I think I have it. It's, it's a pre-order bonus, right? I do hope, and I do hope, I really, really would like if this game did like a roguelite mode. Like, you know, God of War and The Last of Us had a patch recently, and the patch brought on a roguelite mode where they can randomize the playing area. Like, could you imagine how much replayability this game would have if they had that? That's an insanely good idea that they need to do in this, bro. The team composition. You have a team. You have seven, seven characters you could switch between. Randomize different rooms, areas, or whatever it is that they're going into. And, and, and different materia builds that you find over time. And customize shit. Like, dude, that would be so good. And honestly, they don't even have to do what God of War did. God of War made it free. They could full on charge 20 bucks. I would pay that. $20 like DLC that just has never ending gameplay. Dude. Why not? If they've done this much for Rebirth, then the next installment's gonna be a literal game changer. And I I'm actually gonna meet up with some Square Enix people at PAX East and I'm gonna see who I can talk to there to grease some palms Be like yo put this shit in rebirth <laughs> how much would i reasonably reasonably pay for a real version of queen's blood for mobile And multiplayer capabilities. Cards constantly being re-added in. Shit, I'd pay, I'd pay. I mean. It's a mobile game. So it'd have to be free and then you have to pay for like the cards or like rolls and shit. So that's, I could see them doing it that way. I feel like they'll release all three games as a compilation for P PS6. If they do, I hope they go back and they retouch Remake and in implement some some quality of life things like the vaulting. Dude, they should add it to Ever Crisis. That would be really smart. Like, they never had a triple triad app, but they had the portal, the Final Fantasy portal app or website, and you could play triple triad in there. I'd rather them just do like an Ever Crisis thing. Oh, by the way, Ever Crisis has a really cool like event going on right now. It's their half anniversary. They have sick outfits for all the male characters. Uh, well, all the male soldiers, really. Sephiroth, Cloud, Zack, and uh, Glenn. It's a white, like, Advent Children style outfit, but for everybody. It looks really, really dope. Uh, we're going to be playing Ever Crisis in a few days. Check that out, make some videos out of it. My room does feel a lot cooler now that it's dark. That's why I'm still here talking. Because I was going to end the stream almost immediately, but because it was hot. But this shit feels great. <laughs> They need to cook for part three, but I swear they're taking them hearts years for that to come out. Uh, I don't think so. I think it'll take three years. I feel like it'll be out earliest three years. I don't think it'll take another four, but if it did, it would have to be some really, really crazy circumstances as to why, because uh, Hamaguchi straight up said that all they're going to be doing is restructuring the way that this map is for Rebirth to fit the high wind and air travel figure out how that works out and then they can just finish focusing on implementing things to then re they're basically they're going to be reusing assets you know the only thing is is that we're going to have a wutai continent we're going to have rocket town we're going to have probably some new islands in the south and most definitely the northern continent which is going to have a lot of like playtime on that too or chocobos 
the islands with the the crazy materia that you need the gold chocobo for knights it around like all that shit that's all the new shit they got to implement blaze and blitz dang 6 a.m i wonder if i should, should i still eat thing is if i eat this late and i wake up i just wake up hungry I don't think I'm going to eat. Probably in 26? Shit, I hope. <laughs> a light sandwich. It's a thing, bro. It's a... It's a... It's a 12... 12 inch sub from... Subway. You know, I'm light about that. Yeah, I think I'm gonna just go to sleep. I'm gonna get some water. Wash my hands and go to sleep. Hyperhidrosis is weird. It's like keyboards and my controllers just feel so gross and I gotta wipe them down every time. I think there will still be materia caves. I feel like there should be at least. Alright guys, I really appreciate it, man. You guys are amazing. Thank you so much, chat, for the gift memberships. Thank you so much for the donos. You all have a good one. We are 44 memberships on YouTube away from hitting our goal of 400. Which would be awesome. Hope we do hit it. I think we I think I'm confident in this group of individuals to do that. But it'll happen on the next stream. Hey, no problem, Abdullah. No problem, Jenna. Mmm. You just made me hungry. You just named everything from the Caribbean that I love. <laughs> See you, Seth Cyber, Shapo, Anime, Miss Bradica, Koi, Kenji, Philo, Just Jordan, Fitz of Rage, Stu, Marius, Genova Death, Clay. Tony Stark, Adam W, H back. Uh, Rari, how you been? Oh, it's cold there. <laughs> There's actually nobody to raid. <laughs> Except low tier God. Nah, we're not raiding him. Alright, man. You guys take it easy. I'm gonna call it there. Peace.